All right. Here we go. And again, guys, this is the new event. Uh, the new event for Grand Blue. The anniversary event. No, Larissa, just all thank you. I, I, I hope you guys had fun with Tekken. It's always been big. Really? It's oh, it's always been been big. Like I always felt like Street Fighter was bigger. I didn't. I I don't know. I guess I'm just not personally a Tekken player, so that's probably why. Yeah, I I heard the latest one is good. Like a lot of my friends that like don't play fighting games are like playing it a lot. You know. For me, I like Grand Blue. I'm I'm into Grand Blue, even though I suck at it. I suck at Grand Blue so bad. I like it. It's my favorite fighter right now, but I'm bad at it and terrible. Uh, yeah, currently we are playing the Grand Blue Fantasy. So uh, the Grand Blue, the Grand Blue fighting, uh, uh, fighting in Grand Blue Versus and Relink are based on this game, which is the original Grand Blue Fantasy RPG. And I'm currently doing the anniversary event, which has a lot of the lore for the game. And afterwards, I'm going to be doing the challenge event, which is the Proving Grounds. Uh, thanks so much for your follow, by the way, uh, Katie and uh, Nighttime. Thank you so much, you guys. Uh, dude, I'm so bad at that game. I don't know what it is. It's just like it's something about the Grand Blue versus mechanics is just too hard for me. Like, it, or maybe I don't. Know, maybe I'm just maybe I'm just getting old. I don't know. <laughs> It's just a little rough. All right, here we go, guys. Here we go here with the Heart of the Sun. Grand Blue Fantasy. Look, we got Lucilius. Lucilius and Lucifer are different people, by the way. Lucifer, Lucilius, and uh lucio there's three of them and they look the same but they're actually different people it's like put slimy up here there he goes all right yeah, they're different people. And like Lucy, uh, Sandal Fawn. Sandal Fawn is like the backup Lucifer. So I think the way it goes is that Lu Lucilius, Lucilius made Lucifer and Sandal Fawn is a backup of Lucifer. So <laughs> Oh. Here there's a story. それについて君に話そうと思っていた。Anytime oh someone talks like this and and freaking vocal chorus starts playing when they walk out, you know they're not a good person. His name is Demiurgus, really? All he's missing is an A pose. He just needs like an A pose, like right here, right? It would have been perfect. Demiurge, a researcher who creates primal beasts, much like Lucilius, reaches out to gently stroke Lucifer's face with his finger. Whoa! <laughs> この世に美しく力強い聖書獣は私には作れそうもありません。
to i believe that lucilius is in all the games right lucilius is in versus uh got added to versus recently and i think that and, and lucilius's raid got added to relink ええ、実に投げかわしいことです。本来想像とは自己表現であり、芸術とは近しい概念のはず。想像と芸術 See, like, imagine if the Demi Ur Ur Demi Urgus had like the same, the same pose as Lu as Lucifer. It would be actually perfect for like peak evil. Lucifer Dude, these like these like uh like astrals are dickheads, man. The problem is it's hard to find time to play main story. Everyone tells me this event is really good, like the story is really good. Apparently, like it's got some crazy, like lore implications. Yeah, like I mean, like yeah, Roland. Yeah, Roland said. What I want to know is when are they getting added to like the game? Like the fact that like Magliel is not in the game yet is is actually insane to me, right? Like, do you not want money? Like, what are you doing? Magliel? Honestly, I feel like it's another we don't want money gacha game company. I know, right? Sorry. ムシのできぬ強大な力であることもまた事実。友よ。来客が一人こちらに向かっているようだ。ああ、there's She's kind of hot. Leave Hush not another grand right now. <laughs> Magus's gaze shifts to Lucilius and Lucifer, her eyes ablaze with interest. Yo, Bulletproof Kingdom, how the role's treating you? <laughs> it's kind of awkward because I got wheel. I got the wheel Bulletproof on YouTube. I got I got the wheel and then I got Gotcha Pin Frenzy, which is like really fucking annoying. <laughs> like I'm at 72. I'm at 72 rolls right now. Se 72 rolls and then I got the special wheel, the anniversary wheel, and then I got Gatchman Frenzy off of it rather than an actual number. So it was kind of like a heaven and hell situation. And now I'm like, do I hold it at 72 or do I wait for next banner? And I, I think I'm going to wait for next banner. 
まずは追跡装置を作るのです I haven't done the event yet, so I'm doing the event right now. What's up, Undead? <laughs> you know what we should do, guys? Do, 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 you think, do you think that there would be interest in, like, if you got a bunch of people to just, like, do, like, a, like a fan dub of this and then, like, put it up on YouTube? Because there's no, there's no dub version. And I feel like some people are too, are too lazy to, like, create... <laughs> Oh, heck yeah. Maybe a good voice acting piece for real? Ah, oh, man, I'm not interested in that shit anymore. ですから複数の聖少獣を作りそれらに捕獲を目的とした追跡の使命を与えるというわけです。ルシファーよ。俺の作る獣には考えられぬことだ。数を率いる能力こそ上に立つ者に求められる資質だろう。この程度のことは簡単にこなさねばな。With a with a toss of her hair, Magus flashes a triumphant smile in Lucifer's direction. However, こんにちは。オフ。メイガス。うん。相変わらず張り合いのない。he is kind of boring, though, to be honest. Lucifer is kind of a very boring person. Astarotosamo,この私に期待してくださっている。全身全霊でお答えするつもりだ。どうかご容赦ください、所長閣下。メイガスは決起盛んなもので。待て。アスタロトの命令なのか。率先してご提案されたとか。アスタロトには警戒をしておけ。奴は愚かだが仕方かだ。魔王と呼ばれるだけはある。友よ。君はどう見ているのだ。the character design is pretty cool. I think that I think that Grand Blue Grand Blue has like the best character designs, like of any gacha. I think it's 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 the top by far. I don't know if he's still like the main artist, but like the, the main artist for Grand Blue before is my favorite. Lucifer's murmur goes unheard by Lucilius, who has already turned his attention to the other tasks. Many years later, back in the Sky Realm, one man stands with his tools in hand. His name is Gastalga, coordinator for the crew Alliance Rafale. Although, orig although ordinarily in charge of offering requests to Skyfarers, he sometimes takes on other odd jobs as well. His recent endeavors concern excavation. He unearths all matter of artifacts, including ruins, fossils, and tools from past eras. 
Stationed today at, at a familiar site, he sets to work digging with his practiced hand. Eventually, he comes upon something peculiar lying beneath the ground. <laughs> oh, fuck, that's weird. Gustavo swaps out his excavation equipment for a small hammer and begins deftly clearing away the soil. Suddenly going pale, he calls out as loudly as he can to his colleagues laboring in the distance. <laughs> Actual corpse? Gasalga then resumes digging with increasingly greater speed. The finger-like rock turns out to be a real finger, connected to a hand and then an arm, and as well as shoulders and hips. <laughs> As Gustalga continues to dig, a face soon appears, followed by an entire head with the hair remarkably fully intact. However, what truly catches his attention is the solitary horn sitting prominently on its temple. The corpse's neck and shoulders are entangled in the roots of a nearby tree, suggesting that unearthing it will be a difficult task. Unit <laughs> The corpse cracks open its eyes, muttering under its breath as it spits the dirt from its mouth. <laughs> Gustalga's shouts filled with a mixture of shock, fear, and panic resonate uh, with a mixture of shock, fear, and panic resonate loudly throughout the area. Yeah, a few days later, the man previously thought to be a corpse has casually taken up residence in the cabin where Gastalga is staying. His name is Abramelin. Uh, Punk says, follow early because I'd like to art for your character. I've just been looking because I was gaming. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Punk. もちろん君もね。君はいい人だ。きっと誰からも好かれる。驚かせてしまって申し訳ない。後で改めて謝りに行くよ。しかし、稼ぎ人間とは面白いな。稼ぎは三百年ではできないが。I forgot to change. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm dumb. I forgot to change the title. Alright.三百年もあそこにいたなんて何かの冗談なんだろう。もちろんあの時は大いに驚いたけど。コーヒーを入れよう。豆を手に入れたんだ。君の分もある。豆か。豆は食べられるぞ。ありがとう。いや、食べるんじゃない。飲むんだ。コーヒーと言っただろ。ああ。それは黒い飲み物の。そうだね
His expression puzzled. Gastalga starts boiling water in a small pot. Gastalga, I want to hear something. Tell me anything. I'm a teacher from the job. I'm a Do I have good coffee? I have some, uh, like, macadamia in that coffee. Like, some Hawaiian. Not really like super good coffee. Actually, I have a, I have, I have a Kaneko Lumi coffee. I could drink that too. Oh, I love the music. Abra Melon goes on to explain just what it is that he's looking for. Several days later, the entire excavation team comes in. Actually, I have an espresso. I should use that. The entire excavation team comes in to bid him farewell as he embarks on his journey alone. In the span of only a few days, Abra Melon has indeed established a strong rapport with them, just as Gastalga had predicted. I have like one of those, um... Ooh, Heart of the Sun. I have one of those, um, those coffee, like, espresso, like, things that you drop in, like, the pods into. Alright, here we go. The Book of Sky Dwellers on Converging Fates. Isn't this like have to do with the very first event ever in Grand Blue? The the fire the, the the jewel resort casino one? The residents of one certain island are witnessing firsthand a scene akin to the apocalypse. <laughs> But when someone asks where exactly they're supposed to go, the others find themselves at a loss for words. <laughs> a massive whirlwind extends from the depths of the sky and continuing far past the altitude at which the island floats. Should the island be engulfed, it will be certainly it will certainly be swept away like the fallen leaf on a breeze. The cyclone that appeared so abruptly now looms menacingly before the island, leaving no time for evacuation by ship. <laughs> Fucking wellness. Can you guys know the you guys know the red dragon from Reeling? Is like isn't that guy like a basically like a piece of this guy? The wellness fireworm? Wilnus transforms into a dragon and takes off in the direction of the swirling vortex. The collision causes the sounds of the storms to intensify further, to the point where it seems as though the very heavens might shatter in response. <gasps> From the point where it was struck, the twister begins to grow hazy, fading rapidly as though the thread were coming undone. The only dragon I have is Luo. I wish I had the other ones. I only have Luo though. I want one of the waifu ones. I just, I just want the waifu dragons. Eventually, it melts away completely, revealing blue sky peeking through the clouds above. I did not use my ticket yet, no. 
I'm gonna use my ticket probably for a Halloween character. As the crowd of islanders gaze upwards. Only a handful catch sight of their dragon savior crashing to the ground. Oh, look, it's Teresa again. Oh, of course, they're gonna do a casino, so it's gonna be these characters. And then the, and then the card dude, I forgot his name, Richard, I think. それにテレーズちゃんの笑顔が一番のお土産ってこと忘れないで。Oh my god. Way! Uh, Leafar asks, Leaflet is Lyria unlocked by a quest? I wish to purchase a costume. Yeah, you get her, uh, you get her from What Makes the Sky Blue, I think. ポブは俺らにとっても勝ち目にノスタルジーなんでそこんとこしくよろす。ルームコウもないばりにあがるんすよ。もはやホームタウンつか母なる街的な。しかも今回のポブは。ふふ久しぶりよね、公園祭。おい、だたちも懐かしいぜ。前はおかしなことに巻き込まれたけど、今じゃいい思い出ってところだな。そんなこともあったわね。私が不在の時だったけど、話はちゃんと聞いてるわ
ちょっとかわいそうよねドンちゃん騒ぎだけ残ったわけだけどせめて私たちはフェニックスのことを思い出してあげましょうそそうですね誰からも思い出してもらえないなんてかわいそうですもんねああテレーズさんなんて優しいんだあなたと出会った公演祭にこうしてまた一緒に参加できるなんて光栄だ<笑> I'm pretty sure that that was the first side story I ever did was the festival of the falling flame 公演祭が始まる前にもっとお近づきになれないだろうかそうだここは少し冷えますね皆さんコーヒーでも飲みに行きませんか At Richard's suggestion, the captain and company decide to head to the cafe. Before following the others inside, the captain glances back at the empty rear of the ship. Uh oh. The captain's gaze falls on an enormous, brightly shining bird, gripping the railing with its talons as it sways silently in the wind. Are you the Phoenix? Maruka. 私を見たことがあるような目つきねいつあったかしらあ。Oh. Actually, it's eight. I like how it's actually a meta question that when you started playing, yeah. <laughs> あなたはこの旅で得意な存在となりついに目的の地へ至る資格を手に入れつつある Just as the captain is about to inquire as to the meaning behind the gleaming bird's words はい何してんだ早く行きましょう Nodding to Vern and Luria the captain turns back around to find that the bird has vanished Mystery All that remains are great talon shaped marks scorched onto the railing. Uh, guys, let me go grab, let me go grab a coffee real quick. I'll be right back in a little bit. Give me, give me like, like two or three minutes to make some coffee. Be right back.
I am back. Sorry about the wait, you guys. Sorry about that. All right, here we go. The Kingdom of Radlith. The Kingdom of Radlith, though small in comparison to its neighboring nations, Siofan is quite fond of its cultural landscape. Oh, this is the guy, by the way. This is the new character for Relink. This guy, he's coming out next month. なんなら我が国の国民になってくれてもいいんだがね。食べのがすことはなくなるだろうし。ご冗談をここ。きっと君たち10点衆は至る所から配下に置きたいと誘われているのだろうな。Oh, yeah, because they're OP. Sorry, what are the more I must say? Can someone see not the ee? No, I mean, I you also it's the kata. Now, you guys, I got these like these chips recently. They're they're kind of like potato chips, but they're made out of chicken. Like they're like chicken like thinly sliced chicken and it's like really crispy it's like kind of like potato chips but like not Siofan and, and a number of the Eternals once dealt with the ferocious primal beast that appeared within the kingdom of Radleth since then, Siofan has continued making regular visits in order to monitor the situation and gather information on the vicinity. The king turns his gaze to the empty throne beside him. Oh, this coffee is so good, guys. Oh, this is so like, voiced by Emiya? Like... Aren't they like basically the same character? <laughs> like they have the same powers, right? Kind of. So like, okay, so a, a little thing. In Japanese, his name is Siete. And in English, his name is Siofan. I don't know why they did that. <laughs> but like, yeah, his name is actually Siete. In, in, uh, it's the same thing with uh, Toyan. Twain's name is actually Song in Japanese. Yo, she's cute! Holy shit! Daijoub. Rio is Sarasa, yeah. The prince arrives in the audience chamber accompanied by the captain of the Night Order. Dude, the captain, the captain girl is cute. I don't like the prince, not cute. Really? Whoa, good pick. Good pick. Wait, what? もう、なんで俺と結婚したがるかね。小さい頃から密かに思いを寄せていたから。
Yeah, I don't know why they would do that, Shreppy. That's so weird. Like, why, why localize that? That doesn't make any sense. <laughs>自分で言うのも変だけど王子の婚姻は国の刑事だからね陛下から伝わるのが筋かと思って Good taste. I feel like the autoplay is a little off in this. Doesn't it feel a little slow? I I'm letting it autoplay, by the way. Or do you think it's fine for letting everybody have a chance to read it? A lot of these were localized, like Magna to Omega. Yeah, I don't get it though. You know what I mean? Like it, it, it it's kind of like why? It's just a weird thing to localize, right? It's not like there's specifically like Japanese terms that like people wouldn't understand, you know? Should have been me, not him. <laughs> Would you guys marry the night girl? What do you guys think? You think she's marriage potential? I'd marry her. Valuable asset, I see. Did I get the pack? Wait, what pack? I only simp for Sturm. Good pick. I love Sturm. Uh, is the pacing okay for you guys? Like the speed? Or should I like click? I did not pull her. The one with the grand ticket choice thing? Oh, the star, the star, the star gatches? I already did them all. I got Kukuru and Grimnir. You mean those star, the star gacha, the scam show where you like you can pick which ten are in it? Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I got scammed with Grand Noah. The one where you pick an SSR? Oh, you mean the, the anniversary ticket? No, I didn't I didn't do the anniversary ticket yet. I'm gonna do I'm gonna wait till the end. I know, right, Reline, I know. Thank you, Cobwebby, thank you. Hey Anastasia. Oh boy. Anastasia's Facebook Facebook uh, it's Flash Fest next, but like non, non, uh, non raid up Flash Fest. It's 
is this the last roll by the way is this the last banner it is right flash fest is the last banner for free rolls i think その so that was wellness, right? Legfest will be the last banner, I see. Why are they giving us the 100 next banner? What the hell? We were getting two sets of 100 rolls? Are you serious? Oh, man. Wow, they're so nice to us, guys. What did I tell you? What did I tell you about Grand Blue being super nice to us fans? They're so nice to us. Leaflet Pat Cute Slime. Yo, Doc, thank you so much for the vids. Thank you, Doc. Thank you, Doc. Thank you, Doc. Actually, I just realized, Doc, that I have to do, um, I, I have to do the hunt event. I haven't finished it yet. The, uh, the weekly. I always think about hunt when I think about you. Dude, Luke, I still haven't rolled a 100 at all. Never. In all my time of playing this game, I've never rolled 100. Pat, 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 pat. Oh, speaking of coffee, as the Grand Cipher approaches its destination of Port Breeze, Sandalfon works alone in the ship's cafe. With the ship? <laughs> There's a fucking cafe on the ship. Oh my god. I didn't even know that. With no customers to serve, he finds himself with a valuable time to concentrate wholly on his coffee roasting. However, yeah, he is. He is. <laughs> That's you, Doc. John Hunt Showdown. <laughs> Suddenly, the door swings open and an individual enters the room. Dang. So it was like, did the ship get like magically bigger? Look. <laughs> Oh, she's cute. Wait, she's who? Although clearly not a member of the crew, Sandalfon feels that he has an idea as to this unfamiliar visitor's identity. Wait, what? There's a female Sandalfon? Wait, what? Raziel? Raziel? Hi. Oh my god. What? Wait, what? Yo, her outfit is so cute. I love it. Sandalfon-sama. <laughs> Anything but that. Who's <laughs> that? Oh, she's so 
I love that he's like still kind of an edge lord. I like it. I like it. Oh my god, thank you so much for the song. Thank you. <laughs> He's sunshine forever now. <laughs> oh, I like that he has like the little あ、ホパイ、あ、ホピ It would be crazy if next banner... Well, wait, hold on. When they announced the next banner, did they say for sure that there's nothing next banner? Or did they just... Is that assumed? Do we know for sure that next banner has no rate up and no new character? それではありません。問題はここからです。私の優先に行くは現存する天使にとって不可欠な存在かもしれないのです。なんだって。like, why are they so good at making characters? Like, I just... Like, her outfit is very, like, plain and very, like... Like, it's honestly, like, very covered up. But, like, she's got that one part of her, like, uh, on the left side that is just, like, very erotic, you know? Sandalfon takes a moment to ponder his uh, this before shaking his head in exasperation. You know what I mean? Like, it's not, like, overly sexy. In fact, it's very, like, conservative looking, like, her outfit. And then it's got, like, one single point that is, like, very, very, like, erotic. It's, like, the combination of that is, like, is crazy good. You know? Yeah, I know. But I mean, the rest of the outfit, though. Like, if you look at the rest of the outfit, it's like not. It's 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 pretty covered up. You know what I mean? It's not overly sexual, and it's got like that one part that is. Yeah, what Project uh, Kaidek said. Anonymous, thanks for the gift sub. Thank you, Anon. Thank you. Thanks for the gift sub to uh it's Brent. Thank you. And uh Tully Arc, thank you again for the sub. Thank you so much, you guys. Thank you. It's the angle. I'm on four, right? <laughs> Boing! <laughs> <laughs> Anonymous, Alan, thank you so much for the gift sub. Thank you to oh, Winters. Thank you. Thank you. Dude, why is Aliza not in Relink? What the fuck, man? How did... Oh, yo, it's the... It's the only rich... Only only gamblers can touch her. Christina. No, but it's like, I just don't get how, like, how Gonda goes that got in the game over, over Elysia. That doesn't make any sense. 
Why Gon de Goza? Like, out of any character that they could... Literally any character they could have added. He was spamming poker out of spite. Christi uh, Christina, the manager of the Jewel Resort Casino Liner, is also serving as the head of the organizing committee for this year's Festival of the Fa Falling Flame. Yeah, the only way to get her is to get like a ton of casino trip chips. And you can recruit her. I think it's like seven million seven point seven million, I think, is how much you need to to recruit her. It's a lot. Oh no. <laughs> Not worth. Yeah, but like my my point though is how many people were like, you know who we really need in the game? Gonda Goza. Like said like literally no one. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, it's 77 million. Oh god, that's a lot. クリス様の手腕は誰もが認めるところですから。やれやれ。私の逃げ道を塞ぐのがうまくなったみたいだな。特に今回はいろいろと物騒な話が多いってのに。Maybe the staff just really like Gonda Goza. Aurora? Still mad isn't Richard the lovable SSR? I mean, I would have understand. I would have understood Richard being added to the game. I know exactly right, Shy. I wonder what the play rate is on Gonda Goza. It must be like incredibly low. I wonder if there's like stats on it. camera issues. Like, I, I, I literally, like, I can't think of any character who would be like, I just feel like he's like the absolute like last choice I would have imagined they would have added to the game. Like I can even see them adding freaking for Friday before, before him. Like in just in terms of like absurdity, you know what I mean? Like, or like if you were gonna go for a character that you wouldn't think they would add to the game. Also, would you really expect him to sell if DLC characters are purchasable? Well, I mean, why add him anyway, then? If no one really wants to play him. You just need another big, slow, heavy hitter.
Uh, Alan says, what are you supposed to do with the event SSR weapon? Uh, it's a sword, right? It's a sword, right? So, hold on, wait. Let me, let me ask everybody first before I say so. Um, you probably want one copy of it maxed, and you probably can reduce them, right, guys? If it's a sword, you, you, no way, you don't reserve it. Don't you reduce it because it's a sword? It's a sword, so you, you don't, you want to reduce it, not reserve. Because it's a sword specifically, because you need a lot of sword stones. Yeah, I know, right, Project? I might sub text Vampy actually, Winters. I'm thinking about it. I feel like you should. I feel like swords. I feel like you need so many sword stones that you just might as well like reduce all swords. I mean, not, right? Rather than rather than um, fodder them, because you can fodder everything else. Yeah, well, Winter says, God, I need stones. Yeah, I'm in that position too. I like, I, I'm, I'm to the point of reducing, reducing SSRs now. SSR gacha weapons, just because it's like, I'm out of everything else. いたるところで目撃されるようになってるんだ。そこにフェニックス出現の噂が重なり、かつて倒された炎の鳥が力を蓄えて報復しにやってくるという話になり。オッケー。エナクティングリベンジ。そんな噂があったのかよ。みんな
like there, okay there's like there's like waifus that have there's waifus that have like like super cool like will protect you energy and then there's waifus that have like must protect energy you know and the ones like i would want to husband though are the ones that have the the protector energy yes luke i guess that's a good way to go about it I also think her outfit is way cuter because it doesn't have like exposed midriff. I feel like that would have been like too easy for them to do to just have like exposed midriff on her outfit. But like the fact that it's covered up is even cuter. Who are the best husbandos in Grand Blue Fantasy, in your opinion? I like Oigen, actually. I like Oigen, Albert, um... Uh... Wait a minute. She looks like a banner character. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Attendo da nante. Zuibun kiyo tsukawasete shimatta yo desu ne. Kei ni shinakute ii sa. Kyo ryoku ni wa hontou ni kansha shite ru nda. Toko namashi da yo. Nanashi. Yeah, basically, Doc. That's like it in a nutshell. Yeah, <laughs> So the truth is, the truth is when it comes to like, uh, like anime, like anime, I like waifus way more than husbandos. But when it comes to real life, I like husbandos more because waifus in real life are menhera. <laughs> Where's the lie though? Where's the lie? I'm not lying. ラドリスの方を見てやってくれていいぜ。そうですね。騎士団の皆さんの方が大変ですし。わかった。ナナシ頑張れよ。うちはせっかくだから甘えようか。お手伝いを頑張っている子供の姿は式にもいい影響があり
Wait, what? I'm trying to remember exactly what it was. He said... He said people in real life will betray you, but hentai will never leave you. <laughs> hentai will never betray you is what he said. And I was like, true. とにかく王子がこの騎士団の中にいるから、そこのところは覚えておいてほしい。うん。大丈夫。難しいことはないから、俺についてるよ。ね。あ、アンタグ。<laughs> <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the follow, White Tri Dai. Thank you. The captain and crew decide to enjoy the festival of falling flame while keeping an eye out for primal beasts. In the event of an incident, they are prepared to respond promptly in coordination with the knights to address it. Uh oh. This is, <laughs> this is foreshadowing right here. Quick, do another billion got your tongue. I can't yet. I can't yet. I have to wait for the new banner. Thanks for the follow, Burger, you know, and uh, Matsun. Thank you. The festival casino brims with a diverse range of expressions, some from crushing despair and others jubilant triumph. Jubilant triumph. Even in the midst of the noise and confusion, Richard's face remains impassive. See, like, for instance, there's a lot of people that think Cagliostro is, like, really hot and, like, oh, like... I like I want a waifu Cagliostro. Like I wouldn't want to. I wouldn't want a waifu Cagliostro. She's fucking crazy, bro. Like what the fuck? <laughs> that'd be that'd be like not good for my mental health, you know. You're gonna fix her, Fiji? <laughs> Go for a great, great, great grandniece? Oh, yeah, Clarice. Clarice is cute. She's a little crazy, though. Clarice is a little bit crazy. Ah, ne. So, yeah. Aaron says, you know, I'm something of a mad scientist myself. Clarissa just mega with an alchemy. I'm trying to think like who are the top like who are the top like like marryable waifus for me in Grand Blue. Oh. Mm. No, Vera's. I like Vera, but she's crazy. Dude, honestly, probably Zeta. Zeta is like perfect. Storm. Oh, you're right, Storm. You're right. You're right. Pro nice. True. True. Storm. True. For me, probably Black Knight. 
You know, honestly, I can see that. I can marry Apollo. Top one Nier? Dude, Nier is hella crazy. What the fuck, bro? <laughs> She's mega crazy. Anul is cute, but like not really like husbando material, you know. See, guys, like, they're, like, they're, like there's. Okay, guys. So the way I see it, right? The way I see it, there's like. There's like. There's like waifu husbandos and waifu waifus. You know, you know what I mean? Like, there's what? <laughs> Does that make sense? There's waifu husbandos and waifu waifus. Well, I guess it would be the, the other way around. There's like husbando waifus and waifu waifus. And like, I like husbando waifus when it comes to like marriage material. You know what I mean? Like. That's why I think the night girl is really hot. Like, for instance, Michael would be a husband or waifu. Catalina would be a husband or waifu. Lyria would be a waifu waifu. Zoe would be a husband or waifu. Yeah, Alexio, exactly. There's like girls with like guy energy, and then there's girls with girl energy, and then there's guys with girl energy, and guys with guy energy. Right? It's like. So it's like this for me, okay, guys. I'm gonna explain it very simply. Noticing the uh, reproachful looks being cast in the direction, Richard clears his throat. So for me, husband or husbands and husband or waifus are the most marriable. Waifu waifus, I want to be like, and then waifu husbandos are hard pass. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's that's uh that's it. That's 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 it in a nutshell. I'm not really into like the girly dude uh, archetype. <gasps> oh yeah, Drang. I would marry Drang. I would marry both of them actually. Oh my god, I love Drang. I love Drang so much. Yeah, Ko is definitely out. Definitely out. 100%. What, what? How about waifu husbandos? You mean husband or waifu is like, like... It depends. For, for that, it kind of depends. Hi, Milk and Tea. あの頃はお互い... Oh my god, Drag. I love Drag. Honestly, like, Sandalfon has grown on me. I didn't really like him at first. He's a little too edgy. But now I'm like, he's kind of cute, actually. Oh yeah, for sure. How about Belial Slot? Not into sluts, guys. <laughs> No sluts! <laughs> Belial's a turbo slut. Beelzebub? Ah. 
Not really my type. I like Drang though. Drang is Drang is peak. He looks exactly like Fairy. Maybe there's some lore I'm missing. Do you want the spoiler? Milkintee? <laughs> It's a spoiler, yeah. It's from the anime. If you watch the anime, you'll find out about it. I actually like Drang more than Fairy. Thanks to at Jeffy for my sub gift. Yo, CC, thank you so much for the sub. Hi, CC. No, there's an an. Wait, wait, you didn't know this? Wait, milk and tea. There's a Grand Blue Fantasy anime. There's two seasons. Fairies in it. You know what I want to, Luke? I just haven't gotten around to it. <gasps> oh my god, they're friends. Anime is getting a reboot? Is it really? Wait, did they announce that? No, they didn't. Did they really announce that? But why, though? But why? Because, like, the first part of the anime is kind of boring. You know? あの時は世話になったよ。俺も弱かったけど、軍にも力がなくてさ。ほら、聞いた。後ろぐらいお仕事以外にもこういう人助けもしてるんだよね。Oh my god, Storm, you can't smile like that. That's fucked up. I've never seen her smile like that. Wait. Yo, Shy, what do you think of Sabrina? Do you think she's like a peak waifu? You think she's like marriage material? Yeah. Red hair waifu supremacy? I mean, let's see, Sabrina, Alexiel, Storm. You know what? You might be onto something. You might be onto something, Aaron. I don't like any of the Dragon Knights. Well, no, that's not true. I like Vayne. I don't like the others, though. Like, Drang? Drang is my type. I like Drang. Like, what other guy characters? I like Oigen, Drang, 
Um, I have to think. It's like off the top of my head. Yachty was cute. The dealer shuffles the deck and begins handing out the cards when suddenly. Oof. Very suspicious. Oh, shit. A man shoves his way through the crowd, evidently running away from the black suited figures behind him. Sora's? No, I don't like Sora's. But he eventually slips and falls, allowing his pursuers to quickly pin him down. Actually, the one dude who, who kind of like would be my type, but like you wouldn't think so. I'd, pro I'd probably I'd go out with Grimnir. Because I feel like me and Grimnir would have a good time. <laughs> have a good time just being Chunis together. It'd be great. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like Sandalfall, I think, is cute. Um, not really into Lucifer or Lucio, honestly. I think Roland is cute. Honestly, Roland's pretty cute. In the interest of caution, the guards asked the accused man to turn out his pockets, only to discover a black bag hidden inside. Sieg? I don't really like Sieg. Martina. I think Nehan is cute. Six? Ah. Uh, it's okay. Six is okay. Eustace is cute. I like Eustace. Suri was so cono tokosa. Upon further inspection, the guards discover the money not within the bag, but inside the pocket of the original accuser. Oh. Ah,私が保証するわよ。あ、私も良ければ。テレーズさん、ファスティバさんも。with the pickpocket carried off, the surrounding commotion begins to subside. Uh,一条登録だけで試合はまだなんです。世話になった。ありがとう。礼を言わせてくれ。いや、濡れぎぬ乾いてよかったっす。リチャ氏の洞察、マジパネーは。the man points to a draft seated at the poker table. そこの男だ。ん？なんだい？そいつはイカ様を知っている。バカな。何を証拠に？さっきちらりと見えたんだ。俺には関係ないと思って黙っていたんだが、悪く思うな。
With a single glance from the dealer, another black suited guard appears seemingly out of nowhere. Got him. And sure enough, a card is found concealed in the man's sleeve, and he is quickly escorted away. God, I would love a Grand Blue MMO, you guys. The two men shake hands. I would love a Grand Blue MMO. I had like the combat, like relink, it would be so good. What race would I be? Draft for sure. 100% draft. Holding a bucket of popcorn in one hand, Siofan looks bewildered for a moment before busting out into laughter. Kango uh, uh, Erune? Now, what would I play? I'd probably play like. I'd probably play. Either like a draft Kango or like a draft uh, Latch Romantis or something. See, Siofan gestures at the sign inscribed with words dual participants wanted in bold, large. Oh, what if I could be a draft Cavalier? Oh my god, Keita! A, a, a draft girl in a bunny seat? そうな男だぜ。まあ、あいつの相手にはならねえけどな。うん。確かに強そうだ。団長ちゃん、苦戦するかも。あの人、青少女です。What? <笑> We beat the crap out of them all the time. Wait, do I recognize him? Oh, I didn't even look. I thought he was just like fodder. I didn't really look. Oh, it's Bennu. Oh! でも、ここにいるということはちゃんとした手順で出場の登録もしてるはずですよ。おお、言われてみりゃそうか。登録名はなちゃんだそうです。ベニー、あは。可愛い名前なのにあがって。安心していいよ。<笑><笑> Clearly, 
Closing the gap between them and the Flash, the unarmed Benny launches a mighty punch, but the captain evades just in time. Though the blow fails to land, the spectators in its path feel their hair flutter briefly. A silent testament to its formidable force. Takamuru. Takamuru -zo! With no intention of losing, the captain responds in turn, plunging the arena into an excited frenzy from the very first round. However... <laughs> Benny lifts his hands in the air and stands straight in front of the captain. Mm. Surrounded by the thunderous applause of the audience, Benny quietly makes his way off stage. <laughs> Was I on three or two? Three? <laughs> <No>! <laughs> Muscles flex with all of her might. Ladiva finds herself faced with a flurry of kicks from Aliza. However, Oh, suplex. Huh? But before Ali uh, Eliza can retaliate, the whistle sounds to signal, signal the end of the match. Oh, rip. After short deliberation, Ladiva is declared the winner, and the audience erupts in cheers. Ladiva's like the champion. GG's. <laughs> Unfortunate. <laughs> Wait, are they gonna have depression sex? Wait, what? Are, are they going off to have... They're, they're going off to have depression sex? A short time later, the next participants take the stage. What the hell? Dude, this guy is weird. A fucking weirdo. Yeah, you know what I really want to see? My wife fighting in the ring. Like, what a fucking weirdo. で、ちょ。ああ、セオドリックさんと
artfully sliding beneath a bullet fired in her. They, did a, they do a really good job of like animating what they can in a way that's understandable. Don't they? It's like, it's like I, I could tell what was happening based on what, what it showed there. Struck lightly on the head by Sabrina's sheathed blade, the competitor remains upright momentarily before falling to his knees. あの王子、随分印象が変わったな。あの王子、随分印象が変わったな。あの時とそっくりだぜ。Following the duel, Sabrina makes her way to the rear of the venue. <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> Yo, sus. This girl's sus. I saw her on the banner. でもさっき水をもらったんだ。みんなに配ってくれるか？もうサブリナ以外には配ったんだよ。ええ、先にいただいています。ナナシはよく働いてますよ。じゃあナナシが飲むといい。余らせてもしょうがないし。Nanashi hurriedly gulps down the juice at Sabrina's urging, staining the area around her mouth. <laughs> Sabrina wipes Nanashi's mouth with her own cloak. そんなの。クリスティーナ。さすがに付けられないけど、コロコロ変えるものじゃないしね。ああ、お疲れ様。何か異常はあったかな。いや、気空団の。こっちは特に何も。そちらは the man carries a peculiar air about him that seems rather out of place for a casino, piquing the interest of the knights. なんだか雰囲気があるな。何か心得がありそうだけど。いや、大したもの。警戒させてしまったのならすまない。ラドリスの皆さん、ご安心を。彼はとっても真摯なんだ。いや、こちらこそすまないね。警備を任されている以上、疑り深くなっちゃって。ライフィジー。アブラメリン君が探し物をしているというんで、クリスに紹介しようと
While the crew is enjoying the long-awaited festival of falling flame, the, the sun quietly slips below the horizon. Elsewhere, in the forest far from the festivities, several figures gather under the cover of night. It's horror! <laughs> あの<笑> Osiris says, I'm, I'm sad I didn't get Summer Horus. Yeah, I, 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 got, I managed to get her. <laughs><笑> Wait, who the hell is this? Who's Howhead? Wait, who's this? Oh, is that Ra? That's Ra, yeah. We have no clue still, I see. Using both hands, Ra flaunts a cloth bag filled with, to the brim with cash. <laughs> I'm gonna let it play. I keep clicking on accident. Teflon is cute. アトム。ラーニは期待していなかったでしょ。え私は得意点の観察を下らんと言ったのだ。見て何かが変わるのか。私は得意点の観察を下らんと言ったのだ。見て何かが変わるのか。私は得意点の観察を下らんと言ったの
あの青少女らは一体七体が協力関係にあるようだったカフィーボーイズ always watching always waiting フェニックスの思い通りにはさせんすぐに殺害するべきだ I kind of want more coffee, honestly, Lurker. <laughs> Wait, really? Legend? Wait, did that actually happen? Oh my god. Sandal Fawn immediately turns to head for the captain's location, however. Oh my god, dude. Is he actually gonna get caught? What is up with these Supreme Primarchs always getting caught in fucking shit? You know what I mean? Like, what the fuck, man? Always getting trapped. Ascending into the air, he stares intently at the stretch of sky where the presence is emanating. Okay, he didn't get trapped in something. Mm. <laughs> Thanks for spoiling it for me. <laughs> Waifus. Why did they... Why, why did they... Localized Ladiva and Festiva. I don't get it. でも、サブリナも辞退しちまったし、俺たちのキクーダンの誰かの勝つに決まってるぜ。オイラ、リンゴ買ってほしいな。じゃ、もし私が優勝したらたくさん買ってあげますね。ふふ、私も約束ね。
っても素敵でした美しい戦いっぷりでしたあ,ありがとうございます団長にぜひとも紹介したい人がいるっすそっちの兄ちゃんのことかそうそう油目さんこと油メリンさんっすああおまあクリスの居場所を知りたいだけなんだけどね今は事務所にいるんじゃないかしらここからならすぐ近くだけどどうかしたのアブラメリン君が探しているものがあるとかでああもしよければ君たちにも聞きたいんだが実はタンクでニュースウィルカーツアブラメリン君は彼の姿を見つけたのに、カプテンおお。Just when it seems as though Abra Melon has frozen in his tracks. Whoa! He suddenly springs into action, leaping over the captain and the crew to dive at the man behind them. Holy crap, he went crazy! Abra Melon narrowly dodges the bird of flame unleashed by Atom and is instead and instead collides with the ceiling, setting it ablaze. <laughs> Amid the turmoil stirred by the fire, Luria lets out a shout upon seeing the man in Abra Melon's grasp. <laughs> Bro is chilling there holding the ball of fire the whole time. セオドリク王子、だいぶ人が変わったね。Oh man, Fiji, I'm excited. Oh, god damn it. Ugh. <clears throat> Alright, here we go. <laughs> 頑丈な船だ。手入れも行き届いている。Oh, this is this one has a this one has a fight. Yo, me not taka Abra Meri. Felix, no, you must all sit on. Oh, shit. I m k a r a z i n o s h i n o Yona c h o k j o s a y o 300年は貴様を成長させなかったか Consumed by fury, Abra Melon begins pummeling the primal beast before him. Phoenix, that day? Tolima Tomepe! Don't you? Abra Melon, go to the degree. Some of you, how I still. Dude, this guy got triggered. Oblivious to the surroundings, Abra Melon continues to rent his relentless assault, fists splattering with blood. With the help of Leviathan, Luria manages to extinguish the flames. That had begun to spread from the ceilings to the walls. Also, why is Leviathan the only like original? Like, what? Why of the original four like Magnus? Like, why is Leviathan doesn't have a character? <clears throat> Even Colossus got one. Just as Abra Melon launches yet another strike at Atom's face. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. 
I remember when first uh strike thin uh first strikes thin air, the sandstorm clearing to reveal that his target had vanished. At that moment, the cloth covering Abramelon's head comes undone, eliciting gas from Leaf and the crew. Ooh? What about it? Oh, he has a horn. <laughs> Yo, we're about to get real racist in here, guys. Wait, you think so, Mook? Are you trolling or you actually think that? Abramelon looks directly at the captain. Dude, this guy got so triggered. Bro. Seeing Abramelon lunch at the bewildered captain, Siofan draws his sword. Oh yeah, you don't want to fuck with this guy. Siofan swiftly guides his blade to the knee of Abramelon's advancing front leg, leaving him unable to support his own weight. Yeah, Siofan is really fucking strong. A line of blood trails from Abramelon's knee as he collapses from the sudden surge of pain. But the next thing they know, the blood has disappeared, as though evaporated. <gasps> He's a titan. <laughs> He's a titan shapeshifter. <laughs> Before you hit that corned beef today? No, I didn't. It was like... It was like expensive this year, man. It was like $20 on sale for like one. Guys, like, groceries are so fucking expensive right now. It's so annoying. Especially beef. Beef is really expensive. I would have loved to have it, though. Oh, yeah, for sure, Mook. But you know what I might I might go to the store though, like today. I might go today to, to hit up the sales. Cause usually like they try to liquidate out the corned beef, like like they try to liquidate corned beef after after uh St. Patrick's Day, so I might like go see if there's any of it for sale. Money in general got fucked in the past five years, yeah. What do you mean, guys? Weren't you glad to get free money from the government? Totally free. No problems here, guys. It's free. No strings attached. No problems. Uh, oh, fight. You gotta simmer down, dude. Can't we chill and... I even be like a bro. You gotta simmer down, dude. Can't we chill and chat this through? We're all bros here, bro. Kill me! Ah! 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 <laughs> He's lost all control. It seems we need to employ some tough love to calm him down. All right. Okay. Tough love. Okay. <laughs> Tough 
<laughs> Look at Lowade. Look at Lowade. It's like it's like the 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 uh the verses. It's like fucking ca carried by his two bros. <laughs> You've got to be kidding. It's like he didn't even feel it. He heals so quickly. More of the same won't do the trick. We'll have to hit him with everything we've got. So we're going all in. All right, leave it to me. Get it? All in. He's a gambler. Get it? <laughs> oh. All right now. Way. <laughs> There's no way you defeated the Phoenix with such measly power! Stop wasting time and kill me! Whee! Whoa! Bruh, yikes, bro's bleeding out the wazoo. It hurts even to look at it, bruh. Does the pain mean nothing because his body simply heals it? He needs to show himself some more love. I don't know. Why won't you kill me? If you can't do it, then I have no more use for you. <laughs> what? Oh no, look out, Lewain. Fist of destruction. I'll admit... I'll admit it, that one stung. Are you all right, Loe? No injuries, I hope. Bruh, diva, my diva. Did you like take that hit for me, bruh? Sis. <laughs> Snap out of it already. You saved us back at the casino, remember? Abramelon, I know you're not the type to do something like this. Richard recounts all the memories, all right? Okay. The crew gauges Abramelon's reaction. <laughs> Kill me! Do it now! <laughs> Dude, I thought we had him, but we, like, didn't even make a dent. I'm sure he's a kind person deep down. It's fate, but I can sense the love in his heart. I've got an idea. This will have Abermelon settling down whether he wants to or not. Leave it to the captain. That's your big idea. All right. What? Damn it, for a moment it seemed like he was coming back to his senses. A Bruh, Abraham may be built like a brick house, but he, do you think it was solid whack? Restart his head? Like with an old machine, bruh? Us bros are like hella weak sauce, bruh. How are we supposed to dish out that kind of damage? We just gotta crank up those vibes to help our top dogs go ham, bro. Alright. Way! Taha, thanks for the support. Now, this might sting a little, but bear with us. <coughs> Way! The fog in Abermelon's eyes begins to lift.
As the captain and company continue to fend off Avramelin's ferocious onslaught, the light slowly returns to his eyes. <gasps> Yeah, that is interesting, uh, Keda. Ceasing his attacks, he takes a step backwards and kneels in an apparent sign of surrender. <laughs> Forgive me! <laughs> I didn't mean to do it! <laughs> He got triggered, basically, Zero. He went fucking crazy. トラブルがあったのかい。警備を任されているのにすまない。トラブルというか、私たちもまだよくわからないんですけど。He's <laughs> racist against Phoenixes. <laughs> Just sets him off. 俺一人が原因だ。我を忘れて暴れてしまった。兄ちゃんすげえ強いな。回復魔法も早いしよ。でもその角は何なんだ兄ちゃんドラフなのかいや、回復魔法など使っていない。俺はドラフでもない。あの、さっき聖少女が300年ぶりって言ってましたよね。そういえば。そうだな。あいつやその
so that was act one act one of the event the event was three acts so this is act two now yeah because like i remember um i remember so so how i knew is when i was in japan and i was picking up some some grand blue stuff and i got uh <sighs> I got these uh, angels, angel pin set and like it didn't really have the ones I wanted really. Like there was like Lucifer, Belial, I think B Bubs and then there was Halmel, Halmel and Sandalfon. And I only wanted gay angels. I was like, you can have the rest if you want. I don't really care about <laughs> I don't really care about the others. And then they were like, oh, like who gets to have Belial? And there was like this big thing over who got who got to have Belial. Cause he was like the turbo slot that all the gays loved. Uh all the girls and the gays really like Belial a lot. The crew stops a rampaging Abramelon, where whereupon he reveals his true identity as an ancient being. So wait, he's like older than the astrals. Though hardly a, a, um, able to believe that they are what they are hearing, they, they listen intently as he continues. Yeah, my brother was really into Grand Blue. He liked a, a Gilba. Do you guys know a Gilba? That was like one of his favorite characters. He was into like Big Daddy characters. Actual daddy Agalva. <laughs> yeah. Now the lore will go crazy. Yeah, because like the this is like like this being before the Astros is pretty crazy, right? Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah, this is like real lore shit about to drop. Holy shit. Farhana, I'm going to go to the city, but I'm going to go to the city. Oh, I'm going to go to the city. She's hot. I'm going to go to the city. Abramelon and Farhana are a happily wed couple. Oh, they're married. Okay, I can't get I can't get in the middle of this. I can't get I, I can't I can't. Who reside on the outskirts of town and in the house that faces the open grasslands. They grew close throughout their adventures together and came to fall in love. <clears throat> They're so cute together, man. We need more married couples in like games and and games and movies. Like fantasy stuff. We need more married couples like this. I want happy married couples. Yo, what's up, Methylene? As they continue walking with their arms ent uh, entwined, whoa, that's lewd, they run into two large crowds on the each side of the street. Damn, this is very 2020. Yeah, this is relatable. Both speeches are filled with fervor, co commanding great attention from their respective crowds. 
右側では打診派が演説左側では護身派が演説そちらの顔で真ん中を通り抜けよう気の弱い顔を見せると演説の餌にされてしまうだろうしどっちか移動しないのあんな近くで演説しなくたって道がこんなに狭くなってるし移動したら負けだと思ってるんだよ実際拮抗した状態だからね Lately, a faction known as God Slayers have been attempting to convince the masses that true freedom can be achieved only by defeating God. And this belief gradually seeped into society. Those who sided with God formed a faction of their own called God Shields. Each faction speaks of a dragon that occasionally appears in the skies, but they have entirely opposite interpretations of it. <laughs> 落ち着かないわ。About to go to Ikea Bukuro and see Dune too? Holy crap, m e t h a l i n e Let me know how, how good it is. Everyone told me it's really good, but I haven't seen Dune one. So. あの顔を間近で見たっけ夢にまで出てきたわあの力強さには肝を冷やすよいつ鼻息一つで吹き飛ばされるか俺たち冒険家は気が気でない You know it'd be really lewd you guys if the horns touch Do you think that'd be kind of lewd? That'd be a little lewd right? 話しかけても無視されるらしいし意思があるのかないのかまずは自分で話しかけてみたら That would be too lewd. I know, right? All right. おいおい、俺は旅団の団長だよ。そんな危ない橋は渡れないって。団員を危険にさらすことになる。そんなこと言って。怖いだけでしょ。すっごい怖い。Guys, I love happy married couples. It's so cute. We need more of this. This is peak. Farhana, oh my god, she's older too? Oh man, this is so cute. Farhana, being her husband's elder by a year, often acts like a big sister to him. <laughs> Million? Oh, Abermelian. I don't know what they are. But happily married people make Twitter rage. Twitter is literally filled by people. They're essentially AI. They're just like. They're like. They're like NPCs, basically. Nani ga mokte kina no kana? Tobi ma watte ru dake ja, hae to kawara nai ja. You know how you can tell if a person's an NPC is like if you try to engage them and they're like, oh, I believe that, like, like you know, you're, you're blah, 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 like you, you should believe in this. And then you ask them, like, why? And then they just say, like, how can you not know that? And then they just, like, say the same thing over and over again. And they can't actually explain, like, their point of view. Then they're NPCs. It's, you're basically caught in, like, an NPC chat loop, and, like, there's no point in, like, continuing. Because they're just going to repeat the same thing. いずれにせよ、あの曲が頭上を自在に飛び回っているんだ。
打診派が恐れる理由はわかる打診派は神を恐れているの打診派は神を恐れている護身派は神を恐れている元はどちらも同じ感情だよ感情レベルでは同一だけど意思の段階で人は分かれるんだただ打診派の言うように神が失われれば人類はより自由に気ままに各地を行き来するようになるだろうねたくさんの土地が開拓され人々が移住し交通が発達する一言で言えば繁栄だねえちょっと待って飛行する神の下を素通りして冒険に出かけてる You know what I hate about this though? You know what I hate guys? I know something's gonna happen to Farhana Like, I, like, there's no way. There's no way something terrible doesn't happen to her. That has to be where this goes. <laughs> the will of the, the people becomes the will of entire nations, and each nation takes a firm stance on the issue of God. The world has split between God Slayers and God Shields. As war breaks out across various lands, the flow of trade often comes to a halt. You know what was interesting though? There was like an anime I saw that had like a married couple. It was uh... Fuck, what was it called? It's the one with the little kid. The little kid gets reincarnated into another world and he's like a fucking creep. And then he has like a like a like a hot mom and a hot dad. And like the 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 mom is like the healer and then the dad's like a warrior. Yeah, Mushok Tensei. That's the one. That was really cute, even with the really, you know, with the thing that happens. And I thought that the thing that happens was actually like really interesting. Right? Because it was it was kind of like Mushoku Tensei is the people are not perfect, the anime. You know what I mean? It was like the dad was also. Wait, was he really? Wait, is that later? Wait, what do you, wait, really? Is that something that happens later? I haven't heard of that. He was a playboy. I don't know if that's like, did he actually like do that? Did he grape someone? Is that actual? No. No, he didn't. That's not what happened. He did not grape the maid. The maid, the maid did it. The maid wanted it. She did it on purpose. In, in fact, it actually said that. She actually, she actually said that. He, he graped her and gaslit her into thinking she seduced him. Wait, what? Wait, is this revealed later? Is this something revealed later? Because I swear that's not what happened. The novel statement on it? Wait, is that later? Wait, is that, oh, is that like in the novel and they caught it from the anime? That's the actual Ellen lore of them? Really? I didn't know, I didn't read the light novel, so I don't know. It could be, it could be the case. Mook says it's not. It happens where they're at the same, uh, in the same dojo. It was when they were young. Oh, they did talk about something like that. Hmm. The recurring thing about the gray rats is that they're all shitty sex perverts. Yeah, I vaguely remember. I, I, I should look into it. One stormy night, a fellow companion comes to visit the two. Yeah, I didn't read the novel. Yeah, 
神に反旗を翻す時が来たんだ私たちに人間同士の殺し合いに参加しろっていうの Oh my god, she uses a gun, guys. She uses a sword and a gun. I come at the Mokshaw or Kamida. Go see Hani Kizgare Mani, Kodo Okos Hitsiogar. To you no more. Konoma dashing had to go see Haga Arasotte Temo. Daikibona Ixani Naru Dagadaro. Dashing Hawa Soreo no Zonde Nai. Kekuk no Dokoro. Kami or Koros de Smiba, Arasoina do Sonza Sinakanarunda. As full of holes as this scheme may appear, the increasing friction on both sides suggests that it may be the shortest path to a lasting peace. <laughs> Ooh, Tayo san san neketsu power! Kyo sunny! Omae tachi no igyo wa moha ya densetsu kyu da! Futari no namae wa mirai eigo o katari tsugareru yo! Matchigai nai! Nakama no chikara o karita ue de no bouken datta janai ka! Sonna fuu ni kangae te ta no ka! Ore tachi nante jisen de wa taishite chikara ni nare te na katta da ro ga! Hmm... Sotchi ko so sonna fuu ni kangae te ta no? Oh my god, her smile is so precious, guys. The scaly breath down our necks? Bahamuto? Unable to turn down the companion's offer, the two joined the rebellion. Before long, the God Slayers gathered together an all-out battle um, to launch an all-out battle against God. Oh, there he is, Bahamuta! Yeah, gaslighted into going against God too real. <laughs> oh, Skyfall. Skyfall rip. You got hit by Skyfall. GG's. <laughs> it's the bomb blast. <laughs> failed, the failed the perfect dodge. Farhana launches a signal flare, letting the surviving forces know that it's time to withdraw. The God Slayer suffer a crushing defeat. Losing callous members in the battle. So Bahamut is the god. That, I mean, that was Bahamut's silhouette, right? One quiet night late, uh, days later, Abramelin is staring into the distance from the garden as Farhana places a hand on his back. Dude, Farhana's gonna die for this, honestly. She's gonna die for this 100%. I mean, they kind of started it. But now the fight is over. The God is a human being. I can't see だしんはを球団する御神派の主張に耳を傾けるものが増えただからこそだしん勝てると思う先に寝てくれもう少しここで風に Oh my god don't leave your wife Don't like walk away from her Don't go for a midnight walk As for Hannes uh, steps into the house Abra Melon reenacts in his mind the battle against God. Dude, this is Bahamut! But suddenly the memory dims and his entire view lights up. Nada. Oh shit.
the bird descends, showering the surroundings in an incandescent glory to meet Abra Melon at eye level. It's Phoenix. Phoenix. But wait, this is before the Astrals, right? Wait, 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 wait. This is before the Astrals, right? What we're watching right now is before the Astrals, right? So is Phoenix not a primal? Phoenix isn't a primal then. Huh. Interesting. This marks the first encounter between the Monohorn and the Phoenix. Oh, is the new Phoenix like a recreation of the original Phoenix? Is that what's going on? Dude, this is crazy, actually. This is crazy for the lore. Okay, guys, I need to take a piss real quick. Give me one second. I'm back. Sorry about that. Isn't there speculation though? Like, uh, okay, guys, I don't know. I, I'm I'm kind of behind in like Grand Blue lore. Isn't there speculation though that that Vrin is Bahamut, or at least like a like Bahamut's child or some shit? At least, aren't people speculating that? A piece of Bahamut. Mm-hmm. Oh shit. Hearing the Phoenix speak mortal language is the least of surprises for Abermelon. It is more than just mortals who defy God. Many have witnessed a gargantuan bird clashing with God before. Hundreds 
I mean the original game. I mean, wasn't it like Shingeki no Bahamut or some shit? Rage, yeah. <laughs> it's all about fucking killing Bahamut. <laughs> Oh no. Dude, Phoenix, dude, doesn't Phoenix's voice sound really creepy? It's like creepy as hell. Like the filter on it, it just it sounds like unsettling. You know, like it 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 has like a little like gross feeling when you hear it. なけることはないのだから。どうして俺を不老不死に従うんだ。戦力が欲しいの。生きることはできないでしょう。フェニックスと人類が力を合わせると。理解しやすいのならそれでいいわ。あなたが不老不死となれば、人間はあなたの元に集うでしょう。さっきの戦いを見させてもらったけれど、人類は集まってみただけで。Damn, she's saying no, no teamwork. Dude, this is really interesting, actually, for like the, the lore of Grand Blue. A motley gathering with no proper organizational structure is bound to be weak and ineffective. What's more are the differences in ideology and strength within the faction, which only lead to further incohesion in battle. Oh man. Relatable. <laughs> あなたの力と仲間からの信頼。それらを考慮に入れると、あなたが得意な存在であるというわ。それにあなたは本来の力を出すことができなかったでしょ。<laughs> Your friends are too heavy. Translation. <laughs> you know. You know. <laughs> like, he doesn't even really care about fighting. Like, he's just getting roped into this shit. Honestly, the plot is getting pretty good. Waifu. Uh-huh. 
What? <laughs> I mean, I mean, why would you say this? I mean, what? Are you trying to convince him or what? Uh, Wolfie, thanks for the follow. Thank you. Shit. Shit, man. Would you guys take that if you had a, if you had a hot, loving wife like Farhana, and and this bird comes up to you and says, "I'll give you immortality, but not your wife." Would you take it, or just like fuck that? I'm I'm dying with her. What do you guys think? Nah. I mean, why why can't Phoenix just give them both immortality? Like. Hey, Mana. Mana Chromatic, how's it going? Oh, God. What the fuck? You already, you're already interfering. I will share my blood only with a single being. The one hard rule I keep for myself is not to hard rule my ass. You're literally already doing it. Dude, dude, you're right. He's getting 100% gaslit right now. This is bullshit. But yeah, this is yeah, this is this is bullshit. Gaslight gatekeep girl burn. <laughs> Dude, I agree, Julio, hundred percent. Oh my god. The Bahamut kill his wife? That's the only thing I can think of. Like, if Bahamut kills your wife, then, like, yeah, maybe, right? <sighs> Keeping his answer to the Phoenix on hold, Abermelon challenges God once more. <sighs> oh no. Oh no, guys, woman brain woman brain activated. Uh oh. Oh, well, here we go, guys. Abramelon makes to go after his wife, only to be obstructed by the falling rubble. Ragnar Dem says, "I played with a Sandalfon player. Yeah, people are using an exploit, like a like a hack to play Sandalfon. Yeah." And now you know, guys, why Vanillaware games are only on console. <laughs> now you know. That's the answer. His wife is no longer drawing breath by the time he reaches her. Ah. <sighs> I mean, honestly, this was her fault. What do you guys think? This was her fault, right? Yeah, to be fair. Yeah. 
Though the battle against God results in failure yet again, Abram Mellon survives it. Yo, conspiracy theory though? Conspiracy theory? Huh? Phoenix did it. What do you guys think? What do you think, chat? Phoenix is the one who did it. Phoenix killed the wife. What do you think of my conspiracy theory? Phoenix dropped the rocks on the wife. Same brain? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Phoenix killed the wife to like force him to like take the thing because now now he'll be really because he didn't really care before like he kind of wanted to fight Bahamut but like not really and now that Bahamut killed his wife you know according to him Bahamut killed his wife now he's fucking pissed he's considered dying but chooses to live on because he now has a goal in mind yeah forcing the choice it seems a little convenient doesn't it ようやく顔を見せたか。フェニックス。返事を聞きに来たら。さっさと血を飲ませろ。やらなければならないことが多いんだ。神を撃つために。サルハナが死んだのね。So <laughs> she died. Interesting. <laughs> Oh man, dude, this fucking chicken, dude. Sauce, sauce. Sauce.俺はすぐに人類をまとめ。神を撃つための作戦を立てる。分かった。量が取れていないようだな。一滴でも十分や。Then why the fuck didn't you give another? Oh my god, dude, dude. Dude, this this thing is this chicken is fucking lying, dude. There's no way. It could have given it to the wife too. So Abramelon imbibes the Phoenix blood and goes on to lead all sky dwellers. Oops, Skyfall. Wait, how does this work? Is he literally invincible or does he like die and come back? He like turns to bones and then they like regrow? He's like a fucking like attack on Titan. As he continues to charge towards God, body aflame, the Phoenix's voice rings out from behind. Abramelon takes hold of Phoenix's feet and soars higher than God himself. Oh boy. Dude, this guy got manipulated as fuck. Dude, I'm telling you, that's my Alex Jones conspiracy theory. It was Phoenix. Right, Julio? <laughs> Abramelon's sword comes down on God and the Phoenix follows up with an attack of its own. Oh shit. Wait, he did it. Wait, he did it. Is this gonna be like some, like, Princess Mononoke? Like, fucking, like, thing where you cut off the god's head and it like turns into something else in the next instant god is split in twain and the remains quickly crumble away into nothing It happened 30 years after Farhana's passing. Oh my god, you guys are all... Ugh. Ugh. Are we on three or four? I feel like that was three. Oh, 
あ、なあ、3。You're Rin's like, I remember this. I remember this. You fucking bitch. <laughs> like, what the fuck, Abramelin? Like, everyone's like, hey, yo, Abramelin, yo, you want to go kill this guy with us? And he's like, oh, I don't know, man. I don't really have a problem with him. And he's like, come on, man, it'll be fun. Like, we should just kill him. And everyone's like, all right. <laughs> Let me come join you on killing this guy for no reason. Like, what the fuck, dude? You fucking psycho. Like, oh, okay, I guess. Right, Zero? What the fuck? それに二つに分かれていたなんて、あの時は知らなかったさ。完全に殺したと思っていた。だがもう二つかだがな。どういう意味ですか？長く生きていると、どうしても不都合が起きるもの。記憶だ。俺はこれに自信がない。神に復讐を果たしはしたが。妻と多くの仲間を失い、俺には何もない人生だけが残った。だがわずかに残った知り合いも死に、世界が砕けたために起きた危機が原因で、俺たちの国は明
It, okay, it would be way funnier if he was having this conversation with the image, right? Like, if, if the image was, like, there, and then he's having this conversation, it'd be way funnier. あ、かい、just oh, write a backup, bro. Like what the f just write another one. Oh, this paper is like getting fucked up. Let me like copy it onto like another piece of paper. The hell's wrong with dude? This guy's an idiot. ふろふしになって初めて気づいた。全ての He's making the pony glimpse. Man, he's really holding on to that invisible dick, dude. <laughs> he's not letting go, guys, ever. <laughs> This reminds me of like that that skit. Uh, what was that? Was that um? What was that? Was that was that Derek comedy where like the guy like he it was like telling him like it was a mouth based video game. He had to like ride it on his arm because he, he was forget he was like forgetting. <laughs> That's all he has left. Ore wa fro fushi ni natte kara toki ni asondari tatakattari shite ki o magirawaseru koto wa atta. Shikashi arata na keiken o kasaneru hodo mukashi no kiyoku ga umorete iku koto ni kisu. Oh, he's running out of dude, his brain ran out of disk space. That's what's happened. His his brain ran out of disk space. I mean, honestly, I, I feel like this is 100% deserved. What do you guys think, chat? I think, I think this is actually like a case of this being deserved. Like, he kind of really fucked up. Like, really bad. Oh yeah, ask the bird. What? <laughs> Can you imagine that? You go up to Phoenix, you're like, so uh, Phoenix, you're immortal, right? And Phoenix is like, yeah. Uh, so I need to know what's like the one way to kill an immortal bee? <laughs> oh yeah, let me tell you real quick. Bro. そこから Recalling his purpose, Abramelon leaps fearlessly towards the Phoenix in hopes of capturing it. The Phoenix, in response, flits over Abramelon's head and creates some distance. 
フェニックス俺を殺せ殺す方法を教えろブロー不死などもうたくさんだあれから何百年も経ったもう十分に生きた十分にだ早く早く俺を死なせてくれ神を倒して以来のフェニックスとの会話 Dude, Phoenix didn't even like congratulate him, just peaced out Oh shit. What the fuck? I just imagine, like, he goes, Farhana, I had a wife and he drops an invisible dick. <laughs> like, he's like, drops it and he's like, That's right, I had a wife. I don't need this thing. <laughs> oh, guys, my, my mind is fucked up. My brain is fucked up. Oh my god, really? Really, Fudge? <laughs> Hovering over the troubled Abramelon, the Phoenix responds. <laughs> Dude, this, this, this thing is trolling, dude. Dude, this thing is trolling! Yo, what a bitch ass! Dude, Grand Blue stories go hard. Dude, yeah, this is this is the main Grand Blue game, yeah. Kochirakara Imagine Phoenix in her group chat, like, yo, this guy came back. Oh my god. Dude, this is like Wait, what? What? The Phoenix just comes by every now and then just to say that? What a bitch ass. And then it leaves? <laughs> what? What the fuck? What? <laughs> Fuck! 
Fuck. Oh my god, here it comes again. Phoenix. こんなところよ。フェニックス。貴様はこんなところよ。俺を殺す気になったか。ここには何もないわ。あなたが求める者だけでもなく、全ての希望がないの。俺の希望は死ぬことだけだ。俺を殺せ。生きるのよ。what the fuck? I know, right? Really? The phoenix picks up Abra Mound with its beak before soaring into the sky. そんな風にして時折頭がどうにかなって気候に走って死に再生して理性を取り戻すということを何度も繰り返しながらフェニックスを追っているんだ。The captain and company remain speechless for some time. すすげえ話だぜ。不老不死ってそんななのか。えっと。<laughs> well, they gonna start an immortality support group with Cagliostro. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> dude, Cagli dude, Cagliostro with the <laughs> dude, Cagliostro was on standby. Did you say my name? Did you say my name? Cagliostro came out so fast. Oh my god. Fucking ego searching Cagliostro. Sawagio so, you seem super knowledgeable about the lore of Grand Blue Fantasy. When you get a chance, can you explain the connection between Lucio, Lucilius, and Lucifer and Sandy? Okay, so... <clears throat> Lucio is... Lucilius? Lucilius created Lucifer. And then Lucifer asked Lucilius to make Sandalphon as a replacement for him. And I think Lucio is like, a, Lucio is another person altogether, right? Isn't that the story? But that Lucio is uh, is like one of the mega old schools, the voice of God, basically. Lu Lucio and Shalom are are the sound of are the voice of Bahamut. They're they're he's basically God's right hand man. Yeah. So Lu Lucilius is an astral who created Lucifer as a primal. And then primal basically colluded with Luc Lucilius to create Sandalphon in the event of his death. He's basically, uh, Sandalphon is basically backup Lucifer. Tensai Bishou Juren Kinjutsushina. カリオストロです。よろしくね。錬金術。何百年か前に戦ったことが。Oh, oh. An alchemist I fought one a few hundred years back. Rot row. <laughs> in before it's in before. Yeah, that was me. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, I remember that. 
ゆるつわものにこれまで戦いを挑んできたんだ誰かが殺してくれることを期待してその中に錬金術師がいた気がする俺様に覚えてたけどヘルメスの連中あたりかご期待にはそういうこと I love the like the sneaky shit talk in there ああ誰も俺を殺せなかったいや、ビカズ、ルシファー、カツオフ、ルシリアス、ヘッド、ベースクリー。ライト、ガイズ、ダツ、ダツ、ワハペン、ライト、プリティシャー。ダウン、ま、ザンネンナガラ、レンチューニカギタ、ハナシアネガ。カグリオシュー、プラクス、シングル、ヘア、フォン、アブラメロン。アクシュー、ウォズ、バブス。No, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. The one Lucifer killed Lucilius. That's what I meant. Lucifer killed Lucilius. And then, yeah, we know Bubs, yeah, is the one that killed, that killed、uh, Lucifer. Dude, I love how c a g l i o s h is just like, yo, I'll kill you. <laughs> Like, I want someone to kill me, please. k a g u l i s h is like, ah,、oh, let me see. Ah,、uh, nah, sorry. I would have done it, but, but I would have done it, but you know, I can't. Majutsu ya Renkinjits to it. Kison no Hosoku yori mo joey no guy nen. Beyond the concepts of magic or alchemy. Yeah, but. Mada Kaiseki Fukano na. Where's the best way to find all the lore stuff? Probably on the wiki. So fine. Cagliosa reveals her hand. Despite the attempt to decompose a b r a m i l l o n s hair, it remains perfectly intact. Just get Luria to suck it out. そう絶な話だ。正直、まだ信じられないほどだが、聞いておきたいことがある。さっきの青少獣は何者なんだいつ、どこで出会ったんだ奴らはチームだ。普通の青少獣ではなく、牧者という呼び名があるらしい。牧者オーケー。フェニックスを追う旅の中で出会った。最初に会ったのは、ホルスだったはず。アブラメロンは、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サイトに行くと、サそちらも50年を生きているようには見えないがフェニックスを知らないかと聞いて回っているのはなぜだ何を目的にしている何者だ青少獣だ白空戦争は終わったぞお前たちの支配の時代もな俺には興味ない出来事だったがあれは私たちにとってもあまり関わりのない戦いだった白空戦争に関わりがないというのは一体どういうことだ Someone to the recap for what makes the sky blue? <clears throat> 質問に答えろなぜフェニックスを追うそれにさっきの発言お前はフェニックスの居場所を知っているのかおい質問をしているのはこちらだ Guys, I just realized something. Horus is kind of hot. Yeah, or in a hold up. Oh, my, what Phoenix to do you can't get here. What does she got a Hanash Kaget and does all? She'll go. Sasa no Kotaro. 
Later, so fine. Take care. Thanks. The enraged primal reveals her true form and knocks Abramelin back with a shockwave. Horus leaps towards Abramelin and in a single thrust pierces his abdomen with a spear like weapon. As Horus tries to draw the weapon out, Abramelin heaves a sigh. <laughs> With Horus's weapon still lodged in his abdomen, Abramelin winds up and launches a fist squarely up to her face. Dude, real Toma energy right here. <laughs> Horus is sent flying with the impact of Abramelin's punch. Paradise Rosta! <laughs> no. Horus stands back and a golden glow radiating from her entire body. I mean, it kind of looks like Paradise Lost. <laughs> He's like, yes, kill me, please. <laughs> Guys, Tefna or Horus? Who's, who's hotter? Why are the water waifus always so waifu? They're, they're like so... They're so wifey, you know what I mean? The water, the water ones. いや、水長発に乗ってはいけません。彼は明らかにあなたを怒らせて攻撃させようとしていました。ホーレス、ホーレス。テフナ。そうなのか。Because The hole in Abramelon's abdomen has healed up and the dark red blood splattered on his shirt is no more as if it's evaporated entirely. Oh, what? Mm-hmm.俺の目的は違う。俺を殺せる方法を探しているんだ。フェニックスならば知っているはずだ。あいつは会うたびに否定する。素晴らしい。フェニックスと意志と図を測っているのですね。まさか風呂不死がいるとは。この男、研究材料
The Diviners, on the other hand, wish to capture Abramel and to study his immortality. From their first meeting onward, every time the two forces cross paths, a fierce and bloody battle would ensue. This continued sporadically for a span of 200 years, then roughly 300 years ago. Benny chucks a giant boulder into a hole where Abomelon has been dropped. The boulder crushes his head, leveling it to the same height as his shoulders. The impact causes the walls of the pit to crumble in upon themselves. <laughs> Oh, so he was, yeah, he was stuck, I see. うん。窒息死と蘇生を数え切れないほど繰り返したが、まるで本当に死んだかのようで。ガッツオイモ。何も見えないし、何も聞こえない。闇に溶けたかのようだった。しかし、それにも終わりがやってきた。ガスタルガ
Oh, I didn't. Oh, okay, cool. Very cool. Okay, please, no SSR. No, this is the one time I don't want an SSR. I want 100 rolls, no SSR. Give me none. You bitch! <sighs> oh, oh God bless Muku. Muku, I love you. You, you read, you read thing you. What does Muku do again? I forgot, like what is Muku? Big rate up, but how many rolls? Is it just one? Oh my god, that's like the only dragon I don't want. Oh my god. What a fucking disaster, man. <sighs> that was terrible. Yo, I might, I might do my draw tickets. Should I do them? Hold on, actually, I'm gonna do... Uh, give me one second. I'm gonna do the... Uh, oops. I'm gonna do the uh, mobile coin roll. Okay. Fragorak. Oh. <laughs> Guys, I suffer. I suffer greatly. Uh. Do we have any Look more? This whale. Do we have any more rolls, by the way, you guys? Like, any. Like, after this, there's leg fest, right? And then leg. And then that's it, right? After leg fest? Wait, Luo is really good. I think I already have Luo though. Wait, hold on. I'm pretty sure I have Luo already. Oh, never mind. I guess I don't have it. Okay. I mean, that's not too bad then. Uh, but that that that's good for that's good mostly for a primal, right? Okay, guys, one more draw. I believe, I believe, guys. Do you believe? I believe. What do you guys think? Use a Tampar draw ticket? Do you believe? Holy addicted, says Riku. I mean, I'm probably... I'm probably gonna spark anyway. Right? I'm probably gonna spark here. Because there's a lot I want from this. Right? Like, I, I, I really want... Um, for instance... I would really like to have... Lich... Uni... Wamdis, Halmal, Gabriel. Drawing one will only bad for your rate. Drawing no, no, I mean draw one ticket. One ticket. One ten ticket. These are ten tickets. These are ten part tickets. Also, I could roll... Can't I roll these? Shouldn't I roll these? 
These are kind of whatever, right? I should just roll these, right? They don't count towards Spark, yeah. Wait, Luo is strong in Light Magna? Really? Okay, that's good then. That's not too bad then. Yeah, I'll do one ticket. Oh my god, cocked! I hate this game. Fuck, I hate this game. Ah, oh, fuck you. <laughs> Why? Ah, uh, absolute fucking nightmare, man. I mean, I mean, I like her, but come on, man. Fuck. How many Excalibur's I have already? I have a lot. I have a lot of them, I'm pretty sure. One. Two, three, jeez, jeez, I have three of them. I'm pretty sure I have more in here too. Oh, I don't. Oh. Yeah, I have three. Well, I mean, it means if I get one more, then I can have a, I can have a, a I can have one, right? Is this actually good? Is Exaba good? It doesn't, it doesn't have awakening though, right? Yeah, I'm gonna wait for, I'm gonna wait for the. Uh, I don't want to use any more until uh, after. So tomorrow I got 100 rolls at least minimum. God, I fucking hate this, dude. Dude, I got... Okay, you want to know what the worst thing is? That gacha pin frenzy that I just got? I got that from getting special roll wheel. Like the special... Like the anniversary roll. And then it rolled gacha pin frenzy, which is like the worst thing on there. Did you do your uncamp rank quest? No. Riku. I I think I have to do the story, right? Don't I have to do the story for that? I'm on first bell. I am rank. I'm like, whatever the cap is right now. There's like a cap. Alright, let's do the rest of this story. <sighs> After much searching, Magus finds herself tar Night, Julio. Guys, I'm so sad, dude. Oh my god. Phoenix, you.
メイガスね星の世界で作られた聖少女 Yeah, but 175, I think you have to do story, right? To uncap, I'm pretty sure. Wait, that's it, Scrap King? Oh, maybe I should go do it then. ことはったら、こうするまでだ! Oh! With a flutter of her wings, Magus slices off the phoenix head. Holy shit! Fresh blood spurts out and a shriek pierces the air. The phoenix lands with a thud and dies. Magus reaches out to the phoenix's corpse only for it to flare up with a loud crackle. The carcass, along with the surrounding blood splatter, quickly burn out into ashes. From them, a new form arises. The Phoenix sees that Magus has lost the will to fight. But you already did. Fucking troll. The phoenix spreads its wings and takes off into the welkin. Left to her lonesome, Magus looks down to the phoenix's ashes before her. While the crew listens intently to Abramelin's past, in the skies above Port Breeze, Sandalfon alone confronts Magus and their, and their, the other origin beasts. Pandemonium <laughs> どこいてんがここにいるのだろう。坊やにエスコートを頼もう。俺がそんなことをすると思うか。私はお前が生まれる前からお前のことを知っているぞ。お前は私のことをどう聞いている。かつて星の世界を一人で支配しようとしていたア
そして奴の意外を抱いたままパンデモニウムに収監されたのだろうルシュフェルメしっかりと伝えたようだなしかしそのルシュフェルももういないそういおいで坊や同じ監獄の仲間ではないか私たちが争う理由などどこにもないヨマインをどう妙な聖少獣がここに集まっている、うん、どうせお前の差し金だろうああ牧者たちのことか牧者フェニックスの追跡装置だな確かに私も関わっているが差し金というのは正確ではないコアの中のフェニックスの灰によって Wait, did we know this? Did we know this about the, about, about the diviners before this? Is this the first time we found out that their whole purpose is to fucking find Phoenix? No, we knew that already? Okay. しかし、私と直接的な関係はない。追跡装置とは勝手に動くものだ。少し見えてきたぞ。では、かつてここに。Oh, the diviners and enemies were dropped in without lore. I see. それは灰からフェニックスの再現を試みて作られたものだ。時期は追跡装置。Oh, so like that Phoenix is not the real one. オレオフェニックスだと思い込んでいる点は笑えたが、素悪な模造品でしかなかったな。素悪。模造品。Oh, dude, they just triggered Sandalfon. Guys, Sandalfon triggered right here. A faulty replica, you say? Uh oh. フユカイダル。なんだと。どのような秘蔵物であろうと。それを素悪という一言で切り捨てるものとは。相入れない。私を得意点のところへ連れて行かないというのかすまない言い忘れていたようだが断るここから先へは行かせない<笑>坊やにはきついお仕置きが必要なようだ行けお前たちはあ Sandalphon clashes alone against the sky full of origin beasts. Dude, Sandalphon's a badass now. Holy shit. He was like kind of cringe in like the first chapter, honestly. Leaving the search of the diviners to the crew, the, the Knights of Radlith tighten security and resume their usual patrols. S -s However, they soon lose sight of the prince, and their captain, Sabrina, grows increasingly flustered. サブリナは王子様のどこが好きどうして結婚するのナナシはそういうお年頃なのかいやなんかいきなり求婚されて I love her 好き同士だったの<笑>全然幼なじみではあったけどね That's the best kind 俺の父親は白勤めでねセオドリクのことも小さい頃から知ってるし遊んでもいたのそれがまさかいきなり結婚だなんて<笑>ねえサブリナは結婚していいのいいんじゃないかなそんな感じなの Dude, 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 her, she, dude, her face is so pinchable So pinchable and so pullable. Ha ha ha. Ma, she's not a little bit of 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 a little bit The pinch, pinchable, Zessie. Pin, pinchable. Sensing someone down the hall, Sabrina prepares to draw her blade. Oh, 
まだ残ってたんだよどうかな運営はとっくに一般客を避難させたはずだけど Thanks to Christina Swift's response, soldiers were able to lead guests out of the venue in a safe and orderly fashion. もちろん、少しくらいお客さんが残っていてもおかしくはないけど。<laughs> 悪いけど、人間には。Oh boy. <laughs> 俺は青少女に親を殺された。人間に敵対するなら容赦しないぞ容赦など無用このオシリスが遊んでやる世の行く手を阻むというのならな OK guys who do you guys think OK if you could have all the waifus in any end or the dragons Which, which waifus do you think are better? Yes. <laughs> Dragons. Dragons, they have wellness. Any ids? Okay. A single booming swing from Sabrina removes one of the hounds. Dang, do she strong? I dig it. She, dude. Dude, she's hot. Meanwhile, at another part of the festival grounds, a vigilant Seraphon stops in his tracks and looks up to the ceiling. Hmm. どうかしたのかい?まさか聖少獣が屋根裏にいるとか?上空で何か起きているみたいですね。物々しくなってきました。上空? Seophon swings his gaze toward, toward uh, Seodric behind him. Shkashi, Denka. Watashi ni tsuite kite daijoubu desu ka? Heishi ga kumatte iru no de wa? Kimi hitori ja, nani ka atta toki ni fuben ka mo shire nai da ro? Mo chiron, senryuk ni wa nare nai kedo sa. So desu ka. Seophon faces forward again, only then to draw his blade. Only to then draw his blade in the next instant. <laughs> Wait, what? Siofan responds just in time to parry Siodric's sword strike at neck. What? Pushed back by the surprising amount of strength behind the attack, Siofan is forced to leap back and create distance. Uh oh. Siofan questions Siodric's motives, hoping to give his number, numbed right arm a moment to recover. But Seodric prepares to do this guy's not fucking around. He wants to kill. Wait, you know what though? That, you know what's crazy about this? Is that like Seophon can detect can detect bloodlust and he didn't detect it. Dude, Seophon's really fucking strong though. Siofan evades the flurry of strikes and leaps back once more. Dude, this would be sick as an anime, wouldn't it? Oh, there he did it. That's how he didn't die, I see. He saw it coming already. Okay, 
殿下が私を殺したがっていると理由を聞いてもすまないシエテ君の腕がしびれているうちに型をつけた方がいいと思うから優勢と判断できたら間髪を入れずに攻めろ手心を加えることも寛容と教えておくべきでしたね What the heck? What is happening? What is happening? What the fuck? Yo, that looked like some paradise lost. With each strike Sandalfon lands, another origin beast is felled. Paradise Roster! Though hardly a trivial effort, Sandalfon maintains his upper hand against the Origin Beasts. A certain thought, however, snatches at his, at his attention. Oh shit. <laughs> the origin beasts take a full advantage of Sandalfon's moment of vulnerability. Dude, I, I, I love this. This is great. Do you guys, are you guys enjoying the story? I love this. Look, I've never really been interested in like mobile game stories, to be honest. Like, side games ones were the only ones that I was ever really interested in. Like, even Fate, I was kind of like, whatever on Fate, you know? Like, the Fate stories, eh, it's like. The crew runs through the venue in search of nearby primal beasts. Looking through the gaps in the rubble reveals a familiar face. The captain and company clear some of the debris and Sandalfon gets back to his feet. You know, the, that's like the saddest thing though, I think about Reeling, is the way they kind of introduced like Sandalfon and stuff. Like, if you are new to Grand Blue, you're like, who the fuck is this guy? You know what I mean? But like if you actually like played Grand Blue, like it, it's a big treat, you know? Oh shit. Yeah, everyone everyone was going insane when the new the, the Act 3 came out. Everyone was telling me like, oh, you need to play it, Leaf. Like, you need to play it really bad. I just haven't had time. She kind of does look like Astaroth. Yeah. Megas. Megas. Megas? Astaroth is the Teshita's Genshu Jiu. Astaroth is one of the most famous people in the Hoshi no Tami. He was called the Hoshi no Tami. But Astaroth is dead. The king of Lucifer was killed. アスタロトは星の世界で偉かったってことだよな。なんで倒されたんだ？アスタロトは星の世界を自分一人の手中に収めようとしたんだ。ルシフェルさんがそれを止めたということですか？ああ。
俺も聞いた話だがな以前は世話になったなその借りを返しに来てやったぞだすかなはい I'd watch that 消えた Uh oh Teleports behind me M Magus reappears behind the captain in the next moment. <laughs> Just as Magus extends a hand towards the captain's midsection, Abermelon jumps between them. May says, I have a problem. Magus is hot. Y yeah, yeah. That is awkward. A shockwave unleashed from Magus's palm sends both Abermelon and the captain hurling back. Oh shit. Casino team. Wait, is, is she Astaroth? Magus evades each attack with the slightest troll of her. Is she like a fragment of Astaroth? Uh, thanks for the follow, by the way. Thank you, Kur Kurla. Thank you. Magus evades each attack with the slightest troll of her body, a sardonic grin plastered on her face. Magus. Oh, God. Magus bears her fangs like a beast at Sandalfon. <laughs> Oh shit. Oh shit. Yo, is that uh is that Lucio? Well what Shalom and Lucio? What the fuck is happening here? San chan. Anatanya. Oh my god, what is going on here, dude? <laughs> what is happening? Oh the music. Watashi Wait, isn't Lucio super powerful? He's just trolling? Oh yeah, fucked. Mag is surrounded by the crew freezes in place as she fixates on a single point. Tracing her sight reveals. その顔はそのその顔は。<笑><笑> Where's he gonna go then? Dude, dude, aren't they aren't they aren't they more powerful than him? Konyakimi. This shit is so anime. Wait, 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 
Dude, is it just me or does Sandalfon just get constantly bailed out by people? Like, when has he ever resolved something on his own? He, like, always, always gets bailed out. Like, literally every time. It's like, even in, this, in, in like, the, the simulation where you're fighting him in Relink, he gets fucking destroyed and then you have to bail him out every time. Uh-oh. <laughs> wait, did she say... Is it... Wait, I think she literally said, is it sexual? She said sexual. I think in Japanese, she literally said sexual. She did? She said sexual question mark is what she said. You know, I didn't really like her at first, but I, I kind of like her now. フェニックスが人の世に再び介入してくるとは思いませんでした。すでに6000年が経っているという。おお、シェット。現象上にお前は眠っていたそうだな。それが蘇ったという。わあ。何を企らむ。教えるんだ。ウェイ、イズザフェ
あら言ってくれるじゃないじゃあ試してみましょう The d i v a s like really strong in the lore. Oh, dang. With a loud thud, the d i v a Lariat lands a clean hit on Bennu. As the d i v a and Bennu clash, the rest of the crew moves on in search of other primals. So, this is the first time that any characters have had any lore? Is that true? Like, they were kind of just like, whatever. Like, here's like some new raids to fight. And then, like, this is like when we understand like what they are. ホルスだ普段は物静かだが意外と単純でおそらく失敗作だろう貴様でいやその手には乗らんお前は私を怒らせるつもりだ Savage や Savage call out What, what is that? Why does she keep saying this? I'll light your damn nox out. What the fuck is that? Oh my god, you got Gabriel. I want Gabriel. As Luria senses more primals nearby, the crew follows her lead. Get down! <laughs> Oof. Abramelin slams Vrin to the ground as something zip, zips past them overhead. Oh no. She's kind of hot, but she looks a little young. But she's like thousands of years old, right? Naka. Oka to onajiku koitsu mo tegoai. Tsukami dokoro ga nai tenga yakkai da. Omae tachi, kakko gekiha ga mokteki dara. She's so ganky. So you c o u l h All I want to do is put more clothes on her. Is that so bad of me, guys? That's what I want. That's like, that's my fantasy with Roz. I just want to put more clothes on her. That's all. It's my husband, Drang. Guys, I just. I just want to touch Drang's balls, you know? They look so smooth. They look so smooth.
ここはカジノだけど<笑>はいでもここは青少女の気配がして<笑>そういうことなら気付けろよその辺に隠れてるんだろうしところでさっき一本角の兄ちゃんに言おうと思ったんだけどよあの青少女たちのこと本当に詳しいなあいつらとは200年ほど殺し合った仲だからな仏教師というわけでもないや<笑>僕者は全員で行動している時もあればここで動いている時もあったどっちもフェニックスを追ってりゃ顔を合わせもするだろうなあの Dude, this would be so crazy if the reveal, if, if this is actually the reveal that Phoenix was the big bad in Grand Blue the entire time. Like, the grand asshole is Phoenix. I have both balls, the blue one and the red one. I've got two. I've got, I've got two of、uh, Drang's blue balls. Not only have I, not only do I have two, uh, Drang's two blue balls, I also awakened them. Ah, so you know, yeah, me too. This guy looks like a total dickhead. すまなかったリチャードああ違う責めるつもりはないんだいやリチャードがせっかく親切にしてくれたというのに俺は大暴れしてしまってリチャードラスティックオフパンツアブラメロンオンのバックインカレージングヘムノットウォーリーそれで例の青少女との件はああ俺の目的は死ぬことだ The problem with Grand Blue is there's so many like There's so many peak husbandos and waifus in this game. It's like. It's too much. It's like overstimulating, you know? There's one, Therese. そういう意味では貴重な相手なんだ。It is, Naze, it is. It's so hard. <笑> Still though, my number one waifu? Kukuru. Number one waifu. なんだいそこのスロットの後ろだ。I will never abandon Kukuru as number one waifu. 私たちは友情を育むこともできたのではないでしょうか ?What the fuck? Why is she so nice? The other ones are such assholes and she's so nice. What the fuck is going on? Why is she like this? Wait, is she manipulating him? Is she. Is she... Wait, tell me, tell me she's manipulating him. She's using like.、Uh... Charm. Definitely Holy crap, calm down. <laughs> what? What? Oh my god, wait, what? Hold up. Oh god. Oh my god. Tough not. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> 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 
She's gonna say tip? Just the tip? <laughs> she should have maxed out the gaslighting there. Wait, when can I can I get her? Can I get her on my team? I want her. She has the cutest outfit too. Do you guys see a trend here? Look look at her. She's she's nice and covered up. And then she's got the charm point of like her shoulders. But she's like covered up for the most part. Best outfit. She's the cutest. The casino suddenly, suddenly begins to fill with a thick mist. Awesome, H, man. I'm being slandered in chat. Watery globules begin targeting the crew. Therese remains unfazed, dodges them all as she closes the distance. Tefna escapes Teresa's blade at the last possible moment, and they turn to stare each other down. The crew proceeds further into the venue and comes across a familiar face. Oh boy, this guy. お教えてください。都会 連中の中でも最も強いのはこいつだ。だからこそ俺がやろう。危なめでした。うふ。君たちは言ってくれ。こいつは俺が殺す。Or <laughs> if I'm lucky, he'll kill me instead. That is so emo. <laughs>絶対後で合流するからな。日本人のお兄ちゃんの悩みはその時にどうにかしようぜ。そうですよ。危なめでした。これで終わかれば。Stay al oh, catch you later. I don't want to say stay alive now. The captain and company leave the scene only to cross paths with a particular woman. Uh oh. Yo, who the hell is this? She's not like one of the raids. Flames, huh? You know who else has flames? Phoenix. And you know who else has 
a woman voice? Phoenix. Hal had extended an arm, causing a blazing conflagration to rush down the hallway. With sword drawn, the captain smashes the walls and ground, preventing the flame from reaching the crew. My theory is seeming more likely. <laughs> what? The mysterious, mysterious entity known as Ha Ha disappears with a grin on her face. <laughs> Meanwhile... Siofa <laughs> manages to parry his, uh, Siodric's blow. But his hands are full, simply staying on the defensive. Nice, bait him. Huh. What? わかる。話を変えよう。僕の母、王妃が死んだことは君ももちろん知るところだ。国民が流行り病で苦しんでいる時だった。王妃の死因は自分。悪化したんだ。自分の治療ではなく。国民の治療を優先する日を It coincides with the last of the numbness feeding from Siofan's arm. What? Yeah, me neither, Drang. For real, dude. Uh, was that 5-3 or 5-4? Okay. Alright, I need to pee real quick, guys. I need to pee real quick.
All right, back guys. Sorry about that. Man, you know, I kind of want like, I kind of want like some eggs, eggs and rice. God, that sounds good. Like some like steamed rice with like egg on top, like over easy. And then you just like pop the yolk all over the rice. And then maybe like a couple pieces of sausage or like grilled pork. That sounds so good. Mm. Mm -hmm. I want to get through the story today. How many more chapters do I have? Can you Uber me one, says Riku? All right. Prince Cedric lowers his sword, suggesting a halt to their battle. Oh my god, I'm fast. I'm leaving you killing me. For Lent? I thought, I thought on Lent you just... You can, you can eat fish. Prince Cedric lowers his sword, suggesting a halt to their battle. Ladris Okokuni Ishao Tsurete Korarena Yuwa Daremoga Natoku de Kiri Tokoroda. Uh oh. Shikashi. Soreva Ipode Kyosha no Lonely to you, Sokumengar. Kyosha no Lonely. Karini Chikarazuku de Ishao Tsurete Kita Bai no. What? ラドリスの方もきっと君を王妃の治療に尽力した英雄として祭り上げたに違いない。What is this what the fuck is this guy on? Shiete Kimiwa Tadashio Tadasano Motoni Kodo Shinakata Demone. Yeah, she said you're cooking and the food is burnt. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Jack Shato Yumono, a Kyoshano Londi or Nomasare. Doji Nitsuneni. I mean, sure. Uh, thanks for the follow. Thank you, Selfa. Thank you. Kore wa chikara no yuchaku da yo. Kyousha no sajikagen hitotsu de. Jakusha wa sukuareta ni sukuare nakatta desu. True. Jutenshu wa dou dai? Jibun tachi no kangai dake de ugochi. Toki ni tasuke. Uh, thanks for the follow. Um, I said, thank you. Ladoris got Masani soda. Say, show you no can deva jutensu ni taskerata. Hm. Oh, he was taskete mora nakata. We are Borg. Resistance is futile. Chiete. Kimiga kanga eta donbi ni otta. Jakusha Ladoris wa kimi to yu kyousha no lonely ni furi wawasare. Tsukiyawasare ta no sa. Ooki na chikara ni yotte ne. Chisa na arasoi no yokushi roku ni naru datte. Jakusha o taskete koso no chikara jamai ka. Chikara no tsukai michi wa miyayamaru to yakkai desu kara ne. Toki ni moto no trouble yori mo ooki na jikara no yokushi roku ni naru datte. I mean, I can see the guy's point, but... しかし、あの聖少女の一件、助けない方が良かったでしょうか。いや、これだけは言っておきたいが、感謝していないわけではないんだ。国民はみんな、十天衆に感謝している。悲しいほどに盲目的にね。疑問を抱いているのは僕だ
He's not wrong. True. Can't take him. Hey Leaf, how's the stream going? Smile. Hey Fairly, thanks for the sub. Thank you. Thank you so much for the prime. Thank you. Thank you for two months. Thank you, Fairy Blade. Thank you. I mean, he's not wrong. Kyosha's lonely was Seiron to Sarelu Ippo. Jakusha's lonely was Zarego to Kiristera de Shima. Korea Kyosha got taken or Motte Karakosa Okitishima Genshaw Nanda. Yeah. Haha, Oshina Tataki. You yak Kono Fukohes and Kizita. So not to keep my Yoritanda. Boku no meno mine. Phoenix Gane. Hanashinga Mieta Kimashta Yotenka. That's why I would rather have power myself. Does that make sense? Because I'd rather trust myself with power than other people. That's why I carry a gun, by the way. Because it, if it comes down to it, I'm the one that's going to decide who lives or dies, right? Yeah, I can see Phoenix gaslight another person, yeah. <laughs> I, I actually stream longer on Twitch than on YouTube, Milk. Like, I actually, like, stream a little bit at the beginning. And then I turn on YouTube after. That's why, like, YouTube is late. That's why we're late a lot on YouTube. Because it's, like, whenever we finish on Twitch, we, like, turn on YouTube. Because, like, like, there's certain, like, um, certain stuff that's easier to do on Twitch than it is on YouTube. But, 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 I think that power and violence are both based. They're just tools. For instance, if someone, say there's a person that wants to kill a random kid, right? And they're going to do it. In, in the next minute, person A is going to go kill this kid. If I have the power of violence and if I have the power, if I have power and the ability to enact violence, I could kill them and then they can't kill the kid anymore. So that's why violence is based. Exactly. Sometimes violence is the only answer. And to think otherwise, I think, is very naive. Felix said this is why you don't want the government to have a monopoly on it. Yeah, that's true. That's why we have the right to have guns. Violence doesn't really solve everything, but like that's not true. I know you're memeing, but 
violence doesn't really solve everything it's basically the the final violence is the capability to make the final decision after all talks have been broken down uh thanks for the follow pepperoni man thank you like good people having the ability to enact violence is important Before Abermelon's fist can come down to Autumn, the wall next to them suddenly collapses as if struck by some great impact. <laughs> to have peace prepare for war. Exactly. Exactly. Mm. Siofan engaged in the battle and Cedric was knocked back with so much force that he went crashing through the wall. Cedric passes through the hole in the wall. I'm gonna try, Mock. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try the power through. I wanted to do some proving grounds, but I don't know if we'll get to it. This thing is long. This this event is long as fuck. As if it weren't cramped enough for the four, the fifth voice chimes in. Is game a bit like Dragon Quest? I mean, not... I mean, in that it's a JRPG, I suppose. <laughs> Keita says Cedric would get mad at someone for killing his Yugu HL rate at 80% with 3 minutes left because he didn't get enough honor to a blue chest Sabrina <laughs> In that moment, another unexpected voice rings aloud. What the f Dude, what is happening? There's so many characters. Chains suddenly manifest, wrapping around Abra, Abra Melon's right arm and his left. The mono, mono horn's arms are now bound behind his back, his freedom restricted. Oh my god. Dude, is she is she voiced by you uh this this angel Raz Raziel? Is she voiced by the the mage teacher from Mushoku Tensei? She sounds just like her. Uh what's her name? You know what I mean? The girl with the blue hair? She sounds just like her. Doesn't she? Yeah, Roxy. Doesn't she sound like Roxy? Is it her, Yoshi? Abramel's resistance proves futile. The chains emit a glow as they lift him up. Negative? I see. I was wrong. I, I've heard her before, though. I've heard her somewhere. Oof. Oh my god, she's from Pretty Cure? Hmm. Halo fan, how's it going? Sabrina kicks off the debris and le leaves high into the sky. Oh man, she looks so cool with the moon in the background. 
の鎖です剣道は切れませんよ剣はこちらサブリーニ uses the brief moment she's in the air to slice off Abram oh my god Abra Mel and Sabrina fall back down together. <laughs> Sabrina picks up the dismembered arms and holds them against Abra Mellon's shoulders. Yeah, she cut off his arms to save him. <laughs> like photo bombed. <laughs> さっきの青少女はあのお姉ちゃんいなくなっちゃったよなんだ逃げたのかなそういえばアトムもいないないえ移動するのですお oh my god oh no how that commands the chains that had restrained abramelon earlier to now bind sabrina's arms uh oh She's then lifted up into the sky. Yo, she's about to get lotused. Sabrina vanishes into the ether amid a sudden sandstorm. Sabrina! <gasps> Sabrina! Cedric makes sure to take full advantage of the moment Siofan is distracted. Uh-oh. <laughs> Busy trying to process what, why she's been left behind, Razzle fails to notice the presence approaching from behind. <gasps> oh, shit. I'm so far. Oop, they're all they're all piecing out. どこへ消えたの? The, all the primal beasts engaged in the battle with the crew members have suddenly vanished without a trace. Leaf and the crew meet up. The captain and the crew meet up la la later. Meet up. Sabrina-san.すまない。油断していた。サブリナに助けられたのに。どこに行ったかわかんねえのか。上空へ向かっていく姿を途中まで見たがそこから消えてしまって。しかし、サブリナを消した砂嵐。あれはアトムの技だ。ショック。私さっきから島の上に嫌な感じがしていて。なんだありゃ。The crews step outdoors to find dark clouds swirling above as far as their eyes can see. Um. The Dungeons and Dragons, Pepperoni Man. Let's get to the Grand Cipher. Grand Cipher, 
あらラドリスの兵士さん確かお客さんを避難させていたのよねその報告のために戻ってきたのですが我らの騎士団長サブリナが上空にさらわれるのを目撃しましてサブリナはオイラたちが助けに行くから安心してくれていいぜサブリナが捕まってしまいましたよ。サブリナは騎士だ。自分で逃げる術を心得ている。未来の奥様に冷たくないですかね Tufan uses the moment Cedric is caught off guard to escape through the hole in the ceiling. Do we just jump like so high? Like he landed on the ship? An unfamiliar woman stands before the crew. The back. <laughs> I was right. The back of her neck grasped by saddle foundations. Like, picked her up like a cat. She does not escape. <laughs> oh my god. Kanojo a tenshi. Tenshi da te? Tenshi da te? ダンチョウの抹殺を例の聖少獣らと話し合っていたんだところで見慣れる顔があるようだがお俺のことか藤見の油めり色々と詳しそうだななんでこいつが天使に命を狙われなくちゃならねえんださあ話せラジエルそれ
Raziel builds up quite a collection of books over time. One day, a certain encounter changes her fate. <gasps> I swear to God, if Phoenix comes down and manipulates her too. Having been created with heightened senses in order to fulfill her role, Raziel is quick to notice the nearby presence. Oh no 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 This fucking bitch. This bitch ass. What's up, Cole? Yeah, I am. This bitch ass bird, dude. Razio looks up in a perplexed manner. ですか。考えに関しようとする瞬間が重なることがあるという意味よ。ということ、フェニックスに言われたのですが、フェニックスのことは以前別の聖少女が調べていた。だから初めての接触ではない。とはいえ、まだ彼女についてはわからないことだら
Whoa. Sci <laughs> Science bird. <laughs> the phoenix uh, relates to Raziel what it knows of the sun and the cosmos from personal experience. I just want to feed her hamburgers. Fascinated by every little tidbit from the Phoenix, Raziel tries to jot down all the details in her book. <laughs> She's such a girl fail. <laughs> Wait, what? As the two stare into... Uh oh this shit just got dark. As the two stare into each other's eyes... Dude, Phoenix was playing the long con. Holy fuck. Raziel's mind is finally filled with... Is, is suddenly filled with visions of a vast black space filled with countless stars. <gasps> Raziel finds herself in a black space, racing through it at breakneck, breakneck speed despite herself. Oh god. Star Fox flashbacks. <clears throat> she's like, uh, she's scared. Scared of space. Was that the BK burger though? That it's just just a random burger I saw on a Google search. The Archangel and Great Bird would meet occasionally throughout the years, having civil similar conversations each time. ちなみに涙はどんな傷の癒すことができるの力強くね。つまりそれは取り込んだ宿主を不老不死にすることになるわ。それに一人だけ全霊があるの。もちろん今も生きているわ。実際に不老不死がいるんですか？その人間を不老不死にして、あなたたちの言う創世神に。一緒に立ち向かったのよ。その人はどこにいるんですか？その辺を歩いているわ。うん。そんな近所を散歩する感じで。あの。あなたの血と涙を少し譲っていただけませんか？ものすごく興味がありません。研究して原理を解き明かしたいんです。お願い。ダメよ。いや、オブビスリー。私の血を欲しがる存在は多いわ。でもこれを誰もが手に入れれば
この世の断りが壊れてしまうでしょそれは確かにだから一度だけだったのよそう精神にしてやられたわ The omnipotent to think for that one その一度とは俺のことだ Sandalfon's eyes open wide upon hearing about Abramelon from the crew. しかし質問の答えがまだだな。君やあの聖少獣たちはなぜ団長の命を狙う Raziel falls silent at first, only to realize she cannot bear the many curious glances directed her way. Phoenix is a good thing. She will not be able to do it. What? なんだって血を飲んだら不老不死になっちまうんじゃちょっとちょっと話がおかしいんじゃないこの世の断りはどうなるのフェニックスが団長の不老不死を望んでいるということになるが望んでいるのは不老不死ではなく血を飲むことで得られる力です力得意点は現在イスタルシアに最も近づいていますこの旅の目的地なんですよねあの場所を目指す組織は他にはなかなかいませんフェニックスは得意点あなたを高く買っていますこの長い旅を経てついにイスタルシアに到達せんとするあなたが Dude, this is フェニックスの血を飲めばあなたはそう精神の力を得ます<笑>フェニックスの寿命を知っていますかそいつの寿命が何だってんだ彼女が生まれたのは30億年前です30億今から30億年前彼女は太陽で産声を上げたんです What the hell is going on? 最高速度も知らないでしょうなんと高速の 99% で飛行することが That's why they can't catch her むちゃくちゃ言うなよどんだけのエネルギーを持ってんだそれに空気抵抗はどうなってんだよ空の上の空間宇宙での話です質量のほとんどを捨ててエネルギー体になれるそうです最強と言っていいと思いませんかこの永遠にも見た時間の中を生き抜いてきたんですから<笑> Do you like Caglio stroke you back? ですがそんなフェニックスにも天敵と言える相手が現れましたそれが創生神です創生神の爪には後に星の民から伏し殺しと呼ばれる力が出てきました Dude, that's why the Phoenix, the Phoenix wanted Bahamut like Dunzo because of、uh, I guess I, I'm guessing that that、um, Bahamut is like the anti Phoenix, right? Like destroyer of everything それがフェニックスの持つ不老不死や注力を大きく阻害したそうです30億年を生きるフェニックスに傷をつけた唯一の存在それが創生神なんですどうもアブラメリ初めて知っただが納得だ数少ない記憶の一つだあいつは俺に言った Wait 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 this doesn't make sense then I don't know if this is a plot hole, but like, why give Abramelin 
the immortality to fight Bahamut. If Bahamut can just kill you anyway. Right? Thanks for the follow. Thank you, uh, Sakura Avalon. Thank you. Yeah, that's what I mean. さらに今日とさ、創世神と戦う必要すらないよね。だが、相手が天敵となりゃ話は別だ。宇宙規模で動けるやつ。わざわざ勝負を挑むってことは逃げるわけにもいかないんだよ。うん。待て。話がおかし
許さんぞ俺を不老不死にしておきながら勝手には死なさん Okay, listen, listen I'm not gonna lie This all sounds like bait What do you guys think, chat? This seems like bait, honestly This all seems like all according to Keikaku for the freaking Phoenix. You know what I mean? Like the Phoenix is just making more pawns to kill like the next thing, you know? Yeah. <laughs> お前もようやく死ねるはずだ。お前なんてことを。悪魔で実現可能性の話だ。それにこれは外野が富やかく言えることじゃねえ。それは確かにそうだな。しかしこの永遠の苦しみは。なあ、聞きづれいことなんだけ
その使命を失ってしまいます使命を半ばで失った聖少獣は活動停止に追い込まれる危険性が高い牧者は目的が限定されている分その目的が消えてしまうことは生きる The diviners are like that butter spreading robot <laughs> でもフェニックスは捕まえられないだから彼らはそれ以外の方法で自己防衛に動いているんです得意点の抹殺彼らは防衛本能に従ってこれを実行しようとしています得意点がこの世から消えればフェニックスは死ぬ手段を失うからなぜなぜ星の谷はそんなサンドファン particularly triggered from this 彼らは聖少獣のことなんて何とも思っていないからですよ Mm -hmm. Come on, Sandalf. <laughs> oh, Sandalf, you fucking moron. You sweet, sweet moron, you. Demo, what does she want? Say, so Junima. Toto, you know, she got out of Shinji Tamas. Shimpio, Naka. Carrera to the other. その思い役割を聞かせてもらった時、right, ひどく哀れに思ってしまいました。皆さんもご存知の通り。You know what's funny though? You know what's really funny, Shai? We're about to be like this. Humanity is about to be like this with AI. Once AI becomes kind of like a, like a little bit more complicated, a little bit more complex, a little more people like, it's gonna be the same. We're gonna create an AI for like a very specific purpose, and that's its only purpose. Then after that, we're just gonna delete it. Yep. Demo. <laughs> かといって諦めたら死んでしまうってことかい私はあなたを抹殺したいとは思っていませんが実は彼らも同じなんですただ生き抜くためにはそうせざるを得なくて Oh you can't hound? A giant vessel lurks inside the dark clouds that the crew is heading towards. Its deck rife with activity. A mortal bound to a chair, seemingly having been forgotten, watches the exchange. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> よろいって動いてないと群れるんだよね。さっきから汗がすごくてさ。こいつ、後ろ手に担当を持ってるぞ。腰のあたりに隠していたのだろうな。すごいですね。人間ならではです。そういった備えをする聖少獣はきっと数
頑丈な船だ手入れも行き届いている船は進化しているな Alright, here we go As the crew gets closer to the swirling dark clouds, Luria feels the primal presence getting stronger. Just then, the door behind them opens up and a tiny figure pops out on the deck. Oi, Kaineko got detected. Oh, Himia san. So, so, so. Neko, skin and oka. Dobuts zenpan skida. Hitono kotoba, Hanasana kara. Kyokuni no kori zrai to koroga. I could sa da kek. Arigatai son zaga. Abra Melon crouches and rubs his fingers together, but Eliar pays no pays the monohorn no heed as she walks past him. <laughs> Abra Melon is surprised to hear the feline speak. Eliar ignores Vrin and instead looks up at the clouds. Aerior trots across the deck and hops on the railing. The cat turned into a dragon. God, I love the dragon music. Tiamato. As Aware charges up into the clouds, Tiamat follows up with a fierce wind blast. Are they gonna like control her now? Night, Zenny. The flashing streak of light emanating from within suddenly grows more intense. Despite having suffered great damage, Eliar continues to at least track the movements of the light within the clouds. The small small cat enters a headfirst freefall without the grand cipher to land on, having already dropped below its altitude. Neko san, go on simo. Grand cipher ni modo. Oh, Lucio. Rokuryo no suiko. Kopi doku yarare ta no. Yokatta. ルシオさんとシャレマさんです。イービアはベッドに寝かしとくしかねえな。戻りました。サンちゃん、ただいま。サンちゃん、俺にお帰りと言えと言うのか。<笑><笑> 
うっかり言ってくれるかもと期待していたんですがさすがに私も疲れたなあれだけの原初銃の相手となるとなかなかかったるいよそらにだひとまずそう思え他人ってで,でもでもあなたも私の顔に興味があるようですね今日だけで2人目ですメイガスはどうなった仕留め損なったはっきり言おうあれは強い妙な魔法を使うのだな多勢に無勢でしたしね飛び立つグランサイファーを見かけこうして立ち寄ってみたのです天気も悪くなってきたからな Meanwhile 待て Magus who leads the origin beast raises her hand to call off the pursuit of the grand cipher 深追いするな私ならあの雲には近づかない The swirling black mass laden with intermittent lightning grows ever larger. As Tiamat attempts to clear the clouds, Vern spots something. The figures aboard the other ship soon come into view. The captain and company ready themselves for battle, oblivious to the diviner directly above them. <laughs> Having closed the distance, Ra puts up a hand and quickly puts Tiamat under her control. Oh, I get it. Magna. Get it? Magna. She's been magnified. Magna. Mato, thanks so much for the raid. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks for sharing your community. Welcome, you guys. Welcome. We're doing uh, Grand Blue Fantasy, the event right now. Is that what Magna is? Oh god, Heckle. Welcome, you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Welcome. Yeah, I, I think I think it is. It's talking about yeah, Magna. That might be it. Yeah. Thanks for the follow. Thank you, uh, Akimar. Thank you. Thanks for doing the shout out for me, Saber. You suffered from Lucilia, so we off to dinner. All right, have have a good dinner. Yeah, like Sandal Sandalfon's in the story. Sandalfon and uh Lucilius was in it earlier on. I hope you have a good dinner. しかしその成長も限界に達しているようだ。ラ、やれ。I love that I love the Tiamat uh music. Some sort of essence pours into Tiamat from Rosray's hand. Thank you for the follow uh 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 Lee G, thank you. 
スの力を注いであげてるだけだよフェニックスだと What? フェニックスの力の真髄は他者への力の提供にあると言える我らが持つフェニックスの力も同じように扱うことは可能だティアマトからすごく強い力を感じます Above the Grand Cipher, Tiamat's body slowly undergoes a transformation. Yo, can you help us, Sandalfon? What the fuck, bro? Tiamat Aura Magna. Oh, shit. While the crew is occupied with Tiamat, Autumn lights a flame in his palm. Phoenix. The bound Sabrina tries to caution the crew, but they do not hear her. Fuck. The flame in Autumn's hand takes the shape of the bird and whizzes towards the Grand Cipher. Well, what? She has the same power. <gasps> Nani? Nunashi puts one arm forward and another flaming bird flies out in the very same manner. What is going on? Oh shit. <gasps> Nana, she curls up her arms in front of her chest, shaking as she focuses her power. Nanashi begins fluttering her wings in front of the crew. Oh my god, she's a phoenix from earlier. Okay. Alright, we got a battle here. Tiamat, please come back to us. 
guess we've got no other choice. Hang in there, Tiamat. We'll have you fixed up in no time. Okay. Dude, six swords, Siete. Damn it, our attacks are are like splitting in the wind. Are spitting in the wind. We're gonna need more than this. You can tell her power is on a completely different level now. And let's turn things up a notch. Alright. By the way, this guy, he's like the new... The, he's gonna be the new guy in Relink. This guy, Siofan. He's the next character in Relink. What man harbors profound power? We'll eliminate him first. No, you won't. Okay. Yo, that's just like the Paradise Lost thing, right? Like Paradise, like when they both casted Paradise Lost. Ow. What do you find so amusing, mortal? No matter what kind of breeze is blowing, Tiamat's always gonna be Tiamat. Remember, Tiamat, you know what you know that wind isn't needed you you know that wind isn't needed between us. No way, Tiamat's wins. Oh, I think it's working though. I can feel her the flow of her power. Be careful, everyone. Another one's coming. Are you serious? Two in a row is a bit much to handle. Leave it to me. Oh damn. You stand in our way again, Abramelin. Tiamat, Rackham, I can hear Tiamat's voice. We're almost there. Hey, Tiamat, you remember that day we met at Port Breeze? The weather was just like this. Don't you worry. I'll have you back to a normal in a second. We've got plenty of sky left to travel together. All right, I guess we can rage again. Nice. Where's the other crew like Eo, Oigen, Rosetta? <laughs> yeah, they're not an event for some reason. They took a break. The crew boards the enemy ship and rushes to rescue Sabrina. あら感激よ。覚えていてくれたのね。あなたとの再戦だけはごめん、こうむりたかったのですが。これでおしまいさ。わざわざ倒されに来るとはな。あいにくそんなつもりはないよ。俺の息の根を止めてみせろ。出
Wait, is she like... Wait, is she like us? But for Phoenix instead of Bahamut? Is she like the... The captain? で、ねえ、ナナシ。ナナシはどうして俺をそんなに気にかけるの? So she's like she's like she's like a singularity? Like what's going on? Yet, before all of them can make a move, the surroundings turn stark white as steam fills the air. <laughs> oh, there's Kags. One foot planted on top of the Grand Cypher's railing. Cagliostro rips a grin as large as her ego. <laughs> Ah, uh, yes, Kags. Raziel watches the crew's movements from the Grand Cipher. Thanks for not helping in the fight, by the way, earlier, Sandalfon. Raziel suddenly spreads her wings, catching Sandalfon by surprise. Breaking away from the ship, Raziel plunges back down towards land. Theophon prefaces his explanation by telling Sandalfon about the kingdom of Radleth. Dude, I'm telling you, it's fucking, it's, it's, it's a ploy. So you cut up. お前だぞ。それにしても、あの言葉とか。メイガスのこともあるからな。メイガスさんと戦うと誰かを召喚したんでしたよね。あ、あいつがアスタロトか。召喚。いや、それはおそらく意外だろう。アスタロトもな。アスタロトさんとメイガスさんがその後融合して大きな女の人になって。そうか。
死んだやつを魔法でよみがえらせるってそんなことできるのかメイガスは魔法に特化させることをコンセプトに作られたと聞いている蘇生は完璧ではなかったようだがなだがそのメイガスがここに存在している以上フェニックスの力とは What does メイガス being here tell us about the Phoenix's power? Oh dear. Standing beside the Supreme Primarch, the Eternal appears to be equally lost in thought. This world is. 強者の論理は正論とされる一方弱者の論理はざれ言と切り捨てられてしまうこれは強者が決定権を持っているからこそ起きてしまう現象なんだ抑止力だけじゃ弱者を救えないそんなことが分かっていたけどでも俺はくじけないよ天下十天衆には十天衆にしかできないこともあるからねそうだろうの。Back on land in Port Breeze, Seldrick is gathering his knights together. I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm Alright, I'm back. Sorry about that. Man, actually, the dude, it's there's still there's still like another arc. There's another act in this story. I might have to finish tomorrow. What do you guys think? Oh my god, this bitch. Yeah, I might do that, Shy. No, this is Act 2. It speaks of the crew that journeys to Astalcia. The one piece is real. The storyline is a whole ass game plot. It kind of is. It's like as long. It, it's honestly. If you take out the fights, like how long the fights are, right? Because there's like barely any fights in this, right? It's like as long as the story from、uh, Relink, honestly. It's the same story. It's the same length, actually, as Relink, completely.
I don't meddle, guys. Guys, guys, I don't meddle with people at all. Like, I don't like to meddle at all. Never. I don't meddle with humans, you know, ever. Fucking bitch. This thing is bad, dude. Oh, I fucking called it. I fucking called it. Did I not, guys? Did I not fucking call this? I called it. Oh my god. Dude, what a freaking moron. What a stupid thing to say. Isn't this the dumbest shit ever that you've ever read? <laughs> like, dude, Cedric, you're a freaking moron, dude. This is... This is... You are the reason that monarchies don't work. You are like... You are specifically... You specifically are the reason that monarchies, monarchies do not work. Because you're a freaking idiot. What a freaking moron. This is the dumbest shit I've ever heard. Yeah, actual clown. でも強者はどうかな彼らは有利な条件で生まれ Oh my god, dude. 彼らの人生に弱い時代なんてないんだ。Oh my god, he's a Twitter. He's a cringe Twitter nerd. これから創生神の力を持った存在がこの空に生まれてしまう。それだけは避けたい。誰かがあの気球団を撃たなければいけない。yeah, this guy is so cringe. Holy crap. Oh my god, so cringe. So cringe. He posts on Reddit. <laughs> he put this guy this guy posts on Reddit and then makes alt accounts to upvote himself. What a freaking moron. Uh, this guy does not deserve to marry that girl. Uh, this guy does not this guy is so cringe. <laughs> Hearing uh, Siadric feel the Knights of Ralith are feeling especially motivated to do what is best for their country. Although the prince does not reveal everything about his conversations with the Phoenix. それは... Oh. oh my god, dude. Dude, this thing this thing's been doing this the whole time. Oh my god. Oh, that is definitely not true. That is definitely not me, guys. Not uh 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 definitely not me. Oh yeah, I've never thought that before in my life. So, oh, yeah, I've, I've never wanted anyone to do that to me. So, 
私の涙を飲むの<音声>これであなたは強くなった試しに森に入って魔物でも切ってみるといいわ Dude, the Phoenix is playing everybody, dude. Playing everybody. Probably wants to kill you because, like, you're the only thing that can kill.、Uh, the captain's probably the only one that can kill it. So it's like trying to kill you right away by manipulating everyone else before you get more powerful. Oh, it's playing the music, guys. It's playing the music. Two figures watch the whooping knights from the shrub. Let's go, Sturm and Drang fucking clutch! Fucking clutch, dude. I love these two. Sandal. <laughs> Sandalfan wasn't the only one to overhear the primal beasts conversing in the forest when the festival of falling flame was still in procession. Wait, what? Once the prim primal beasts have scattered and Sandalfon has taken his leave, Sturm and Drang stand up. Dude, I love them. I love Sturm and Drang. They're so clutch. They're always so clutch. I like Drang because Drang plays the fool, but he's actually really smart. He just kind of acts like an idiot, but he's, he's actually like pretty smart. Try as they might, the two are una unable to come with a logical answer. They don't have the whole picture. The black clouds have vanished without a trace, and the mysterious ship is no longer in sight. Okay. <laughs> Dude, Sandalfon, that was my fault for being too complacent. Sandalfon is like complacent, like in the dictionary. Like, like under the word complacent, it would just say Sandalfon and have a big picture of him. This guy constantly gets fucked, despite how powerful he is. He's a freaking moron. I still love him, but he's a little dumb dumb. Preparing to once again make landfall in Port Breeze, the Grand Cipher begins its descent. To be continued. Okay, that's Act 2. Damn. Should we do this? Wait, is this four attempts like today or is this ever? Yeah, that's crazy, man. It's so crazy. Ever? Oh, wind, really? Wait, but isn't this Tiamat? Why is it wind? Oh no, it's not Tiamat, it's this dude. Abra Abra Melon. Oh, come on. 
軍神の施しその身に受けるがよいなあスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌスパヌGod, I gotta make like new parties and stuff. I feel like I wanna. I want a manual, right? Probably. It's dark, right? Probably. But I kind of want to use like other characters, I think. Because you can have like multiple, right? Need more than one party. Yeah. How's my dark grid looking? I got, uh... I got... It's, it's my dark... My dark grid. Like that. Right there. Okay, it's not it's not the greatest, but it's okay. Yeah, no worries, Kishin. Oh my God, full enemy. <laughs> I mean, I I mean, like I can switch these to axes, I guess, if I pay a little bit. Ancient but usable, yeah. I do have like one fed spine. I've got this Claws of Terror. Unworldly boost. Uh, any luck, Riku? Oh man, it sucks. Anyway, I think yeah, I'm, I think I'm gonna take a break for today and then we'll come back tomorrow. To finish off the event story, and then we'll do some proving grounds as well tomorrow. Um, after that, I don't know. Probably, uh, probably some anime game. We'll see. Did I get free weapon tickets? Uh, I didn't. I didn't use them. Actually, I still have them. I still have all of them. What time tomorrow? Uh, probably start at around 12, Mook. Double Agony is the most worth. Uh, it's what I'm thinking about getting, actually. Thank you, uh, Ron Colossal. Thank you. Yeah, and then we'll do some Proving Grounds after we do, like, the, the rest of the story. The okay, so far, the story is pretty crazy. I like it a lot. It's really, it's really good. Like, would make a great game story, honestly. So I'm pretty excited to to try it out. Um, I'm I'm really excited to like finish it up and see what what I get at the end. Draw the ten, do that, dude. I could totally fight those those guys. Look, all of them are in here. I don't think I need any of them though. 
last time I fought Atom, he just fucked me up when I fought him last time. I beat up Osiris for free. And, uh, and Tefnut for free. Anyway. Alright guys, thanks for hanging out with me. I will see you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow for the, uh, the finale, Act 3, of the Grand Blue Anniversary event. Alright, peace out.